Good evening, party people, and welcome back to the bar. I've got Imi Chow joining us e this evening, whose face is slightly obscured by the recipe above. Don't worry, this is exactly the conversation that we'll be having in a little bit, so I'm actually going to hide that for a little while, so not only can we look at Imi Chow, but we can also look at Papyrus, who's hiding one of our crucial ingredients yet again this week, just like the egotistical like maniac Chow that he is. Moment, I'm sorry. Oh, that's okay. No, that's totally fine. So, before we get into our pre-show cocktail, an upcoming feature of what's happening here at the bar with an X is we've got cocktails coming to you next Wednesday at 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Pending about exactly a week from right now, we'll be presenting four new cocktails inspired by the characters from Undertale. I've they'll announce them in the Discord. There'll be an official announcement coming out onto the other various forms of social media that exist in our beautiful world that we call Earth and the internet or somewhat. So the cocktail that we got this evening is kind of inspired by what we're about to encounter in the game itself. We haven't found Metaton yet, and we haven't gotten to his resort yet. Metaton's theme is called Metal Crusher. I think of Metal Crushing, I also think of like leaf smashing or leaf muddling. So that's why we have muddlers and glasses. There's a hotel that has a theme called, can you really call this a hotel? I didn't even get a mint on my pillow or anything. So it also has mint in it, which is the beautiful new made basil, basil, it's a mint plant. It's new to the bar, another pet that we have. And uh, their name is mint spelled backwards with a silent N inspired by the name that chat actually gave the basil plant, which is basil spelled backwards with a silent B last week. So y'all can do the math on your own. How'd uh, they fit all that on the birth certificate? I don't know. I don't even know where the birth certificate is. That, those types of legal documents, we don't technically have a space, safe space for aside in the fireplace that has never been used and continues to sit almost menacingly across the room from us. I kind of want to set this place on fire, but like in, in a way that is properly controlled. But anyways. And then the other, well, actually I already made the three-way reference. It was the mint that should have been on my pillow in the NTT resort, uh, metal crusher, mint muddler, and then the mint plant, because we have a new mint plant. And that's all the ways we got. So we have a cocktail this evening, and we'll do things there. I have this book called The Home Bartender by Shane Carley, author of The Mason Jar Cocktail Companion, and I am not even remotely familiar with this author. This was a book that was given to me by my beautiful grandmother, and in it has a simple recipe for how to smash Waylands. I don't know what a Waylan is, um, but apparently it's made up of at least lemon, mint, bourbon, and ginger beer. What exactly is going on in this cocktail here? All right, let's see. Whiskey and ginger is a time-honored flavor combination, but precious few whiskey cocktails include mint. The Whalen Smash forgoes the ginger liqueurs that similar cocktails call for, instead adding a splash of ginger ale to give the drink some added lightness. This is ginger beer, though. Continue. The carbonation gives the drink a playful element, but doesn't overwhelm the palate, leaving plenty of room for the mint and lemon to play off each other. They used every single ingredient as a buzzword in that description. Five out of five subscription. Five, five, five out of five description. I love that. I have really wished that the author would have given some inclination of why this is called the Whalen Smash. Again, the recipe for that, I'll just flash up here for just a moment. If you type in exclamation point sips on the Twitch chat, or if you just look in the description of the video on the YouTube side, you will also find it as well, and we'll follow along as we create this pre-show cocktail. There's no explanation here why it's called a Whalen Smash. I thought it was just a whiskey smash. That's what I was trying to find. And this is technically a whiskey, ginger, and mint smash. But that's what we have. So that's what we're gonna make. And because we have guests here this evening, it's great. Ibi Chow came all the way down here to the kingdom of Spring Garden, city of brotherly love, just to, just to kind of say hi. And of course, make her rounds as she usually does. She's the one of the other bartenders with an X that make their way frequently to the bar with an X to make up their own cocktail creations. I don't think that you have any specific original creations that are public as of yet, but unless, unless. No. It's okay. It's okay. It is a, it is a, it was a long time since I made my first original cocktail recipe. Dare I say it took me at least 22 years since I breached my mother. We have time. We have time to spare. So the first thing that we're going to need for this cocktail recipe, I realize I actually took the recipe off screen, so I'm going to open back up the book again. Usually I can just look right there. We need a half of a lemon cut into thirds. We will add that and muddle it into four mint leaves, three parts of bourbon whiskey, and one part of ginger beer. So we have a lemon. 
Ooh, but there's a second lemon in there. There was actually two lemons that we grabbed this evening. One is for garnish, and one we got from the freezer, because freezer lemons are good for juicing. So instead of grabbing the firm lemon, would you mind grabbing the really uncomfortably cold and squishy lemon that's sitting in the fruit basket? I would mind, but I don't think I have a choice. Does this make a sound when you squish it? Oh, Can you yeah, hear that? it does. Can y'all hear that? It shouldn't make that sound. I don't even know if y'all can that, hear that. That's like the opposite of ASMR. <laughs> Happy International Whiskey Day, says Jay Swizzle. I didn't even know. Jay Swizzle, how are you aware of every single national holiday that pertains to liquor? It's either a talent, a problem, or somewhere betwixt. That's really cool. You were the one who last time came here and said it was National Kahlua Day on the same day as Pokemon Day. I thought it was really awesome. Welcome in, Jay Swizzle. For those of the other folks out here who are looking for recipes, excuse, sorry about that. I okay. whacked your elbow. Jay Swizzle also has a bar of his own, which to this point in time, to my knowledge, does not have a name. So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna take this lemon. We're making two cocktails this evening. So we're gonna take a whole lemon, we're gonna cut it in half, and then we're gonna make three wedges from each of those, which are gonna go at the bottom of our glasses here, which will be muddled in addition to some mint over there. I'm not trying to threaten anybody with this knife. I'm just trying to be theatrical with it. But yes, it is a real knife. So the way I like to make these particular wedges, I have to be careful so that I don't like inadvertently juice this lemon before it gets a chance to be in the cocktail. I'm gonna cut it down the side like this. It's already very juicy. And I'll cut from one end, trying not to, trying to be very careful with this, as careful as I can be. So, here's some very limp lemons for your glass. This is what the recipe calls for, all of those lemons. And then I'll get some slices for my glass. There we go. Jay Swizzle says, true story, it's a true story. Never heard a truer story in my life. And we're gonna pop that in there. So, step number one, after you're done cleaning up your lemon pieces and throwing them into the nearest receptacle, which in our case is a plastic bucket named Taylor, who frequents the bar often, we need to muddle these things. So we're gonna we're gonna take our lemon slices and just kind of like it doesn't say like lightly muddle or anything. We're just gonna juice the hell out of these things, and there's a lot of juice to give. If anybody is struggling to get the most juice out of their lemons, the first thing that you can try is like rolling it in your hands a little bit. But if you're tired and lazy and like want to find shortcuts, then you can just stick it in your freezer, let it freeze, and then dethaw it. And it basically does all the juicing for you. It's an excellent trick. The idea here is to get all the juice out and all the oils. And, and I guess all the little bits of pith and other pieces and stuff as well. But to keep those muddlers for a moment, we now need four mint leaves a piece. But honestly, it's kind of however many mint leaves floats your boat, whatever you have a preference for. So Tim over here, AKA mint spelled backwards with a silent N, you're free to take your mint leaves. I really like mint and I feel like this is going to be a very, very lemon forward cocktail. So I'm actually gonna try to go for like six of these leaves. I want this to be very minty and then see whether or not I regret it later. What are you kind of going for? I'm a play safe. Safe is probably a good way of going. We respect everybody's stances around here at the bar with an X. Great. Thank you, mint spelled backwards with a silent N. Thank you very much. We're gonna conduct the muddling again, doing the exact same thing that we did earlier. But now we're gonna try to get some like mint oils in there and mint juices all combined with our lemon juices. Basically, this is like, like two thirds lemonade, except there's absolutely no sugar in this, aside from what is provided by the actual ingredients so far. This is why they call it a smash. Big lemon smash. We won't be needing these anymore, so I'll give those to Taylor in the bucket. Now, maybe some ice. We're gonna grab, not large cubes this time. We're gonna try to get some smaller cubes. I'm just taking the, the, the ice cubes that you can get from the most of the trees that you can get in the store. There we go. And don't worry if you break this thing. I hate it, despise it, and it cost me a couple cents. So that's fine. We're basically, there we go, exactly. We're gonna grab our ice cubes. Just kind of put them in our glass. Feel free to go for it. I'll clean this after the fact, if you can get them out. I'm gonna fill mine with four cubes. There we go. Here. Oh. How many would you like? I have three of them. I think that'll probably be good. I'm gonna do 
floor. I want mine nice and cold. We're good with that. You sure you don't want that anymore? I'm sure. Perfect, perfect. Next, we're going to need to add three ounces, or rather, the book specifically calls for three parts bourbon to one part ginger beer. My theory is that you can use your part as the equivalent to an ounce or about 30 milliliters. I don't know whether that's actually the case or not, but our bourbon's actually hiding behind Papyrus up there. I'll grab him from the front. We'll take the bar with the Nexus specialty blend of infinity bourbon, and Papyrus can just like kind of sit back here a little bit and hang on top of the cutting board. There you go, buddy. Oh, please don't. No, just okay. You're being a problem. Peace out, Papyrus. There we go. So we need three ounces of our infinity bourbon. Unfortunately, I don't have a measuring jigger that's that large, so we're just gonna have to pour one into each side. Three ounces, we're gonna see if this actually works, or about 88 milliliters of your bourbon. We're gonna start out with the two side. Whoop, there we go. Start with two. That's working so far. I was gonna lose faith. Pop it over to the other side. We'll do one more ounce for a total of three. This feels like it's gonna be a very whiskey heavy drink, but apparently, Maybe flavors balance out a little bit better. There we go. All done with that. We'll throw those away. Back into the buckets. Uh, don't we still need it for the ounce of- You're absolutely right. I got ahead of myself. We will need those later. Okay, hold on, hold on. It's okay, it's okay. I'm not picky. I'll just use this one again. Taylor's not super dirty right now. She's just getting started. Can I ask you to grab me a bottle of bourbon from beneath the bar, and we're gonna fill this infinity bottle back up to the top before we put it away for next time. This one right in the middle, this Cleveland bottle of bourbon. Yeah, that one. This is a rapidly aged bourbon, and I don't, I still question whether it's, you can legally call it bourbon or not, but it does say bourbon on the bottle, so that's exactly what I'm going to call it. I'm gonna take six ounces and put that back in here. Will that finish off the bottle? Unfortunately, no. There's still more of this left. So long as this bottle remains not empty, I will continue using it. That was very helpful, thank you. Next, we're going to need ginger beer. This recipe specifically calls for ginger beer. Despite the fact that the description told us that we were using ginger ale, we're not actually using ginger ale, which to me brings in a question of whether or not the author knew what they were talking about. I have no idea, but I gotta have faith. I've gotta have faith. There we go. I think you might actually need a bottle opener for that. Unless it pops right off. Do it though. No, it's gonna need a bottle opener. Uh, uh, there you are, bottle openers. In the middle of the flaps of the tackle box. I rearranged the bar over here so I don't actually have any right now. But if you go to the side of the tackle box, on the left-hand side, and put your fingers in the flaps between, there will be bottle openers there. They kind of look like metal plates of stuff with holes in them. Yeah, like right in line with this thing here. A little to your right. On the bottom, it should be on top of the refrigerator. Okay, it's okay. I, I got one right over here. They're hidden. Oh, that's what you meant. By You're that. totally good because you are the third person I've tried to instruct to find these and nobody has been able to successfully find them so far, which just means that I need to put these in a better location. Would you like to do the honors? I, I feel like I deserve to give you the honors of at least opening the bottle of ginger beer because I, I certainly don't deserve to be the one to open that. Be my guest. One part, or about like an ounce of ginger beer. I'm gonna watch what you do with yours and see where that wash line gets. And I'm gonna do the cool bartender thing and watch as you pour a shot for me. Thank you. And then, there we go. And that's it. That's actually got a really nice gradient to it. It does have a very nice gradient to it. We're not quite done yet because we're never fully dressed without a smile. So they say, may I have the lemon and lime that's in the fruit basket? Let's make some garnishes. Now, I'm gonna take this knife out again. Honestly, I'm just gonna cut a wheel with both of these and then I'm just gonna cut it in half. 
One lime, halved. One lime, sliced, wheeled. There we go. One lemon, sliced. One lemon, circled. There we go. We'll put these away for later. Do you mind putting these back in the fruits basket? I will put those and reuse them for later. And then I'm just gonna take these wheels and I'm gonna cut them in half. Trying to follow the pith lines as best as I can. A little slit in the middle. A little slit in the middle. And there you go. Feel free to grab a citrus and garnish your glass. There we go. One little orange. Orange. <laughs> One little lime. One little lemon. There we go. There you go. We've got ourselves our two. Right the first one. Nice. Perfection. We'll do a little cleanup. And we're all good. We've got ourselves. At least what the book is calling whale and smashes. And to be perfectly honest, I feel like this needs a mix. Does this book say anything about mixing? Pour in the bourbon. Top with ginger beer. Stir together. Stir together. Stir together. Stir together. Stir together. Which I guess is kind of difficult now that I've put a garnish on it and there's a bunch of gunk at the bottom of the glass, but I think we just like agitated it a little bit. Everything's gonna be just fine. Oh, okay. Here we go. Oh my goodness gracious. I feel like that needs to be agitated a bit more. I feel like, I feel like I need more lemon juice in there. Wowza. And I got a little piece of my mint. Here we go. Woo! Oh my goodness gracious. Get a load of that. What do you think so far? Why did I do that? That's honestly, when I'm building cocktails, I've seen other bartenders and mixologists do this too. You can put a little bit of liquid on like the top of your hand and you just like sip it. You can taste it. Honestly, I've been informed that some bartenders, like professional bartenders behind the bar will do the same thing while they're mixing drinks up, especially like improv style, just to see whether or not they got the balance that they're looking for. So we have here two finely made Waylon smashes, which are basically just whis whiskey ginger mint spats. Whiskey ginger mint smashes. Cheers. What do you think? Wow. It's very forward on the bourbon. What do you think? Yeah, it is. I, I don't know why I was expecting it to, to have more carbonation. There was only like a little bit of uh, the ginger beer in it. Oddly enough, I am getting a lot of the ginger beer component. At first, when I took my first sip, it was very forward on the whiskey. It still is very forward on the whiskey. Do not get me wrong there. But there's like an undeniable taste of ginger beer. And granted, the last time I had ginger beer was from this bottle, a two liter bottle of soda that had been sitting in the closet for about three years. And I cracked that open earlier today and realized I need more ginger beer. And luckily we got the fever tree. How's that hitting you? Is the ginger finally hitting? No, uh, my stomach was turning just thinking of that one bottle. Oh, yeah. Imagine uh, um, at least half a liter of ginger beer sitting in a closet in a plastic cream soda container that looks like it's had its own environment forming on the inside, its own little ecosystem, and you crack that open, the bottle is deformed, it's still deformed, and it smells like a cargo shed, and it tastes like a spicy cargo shed. I think for the interest of, uh, you know, holding my drink in, I'll not no, imagine no, that. No, 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 don't, don't. For the folks at home who are daring, though, you're more than welcome to. If it needs sweetening, I would add honey syrup. Honey would go excellent here, especially with your bourbon. I'd say to that, for this one in particular, Wait. there was a lot going on. Actually, do you want to try some sweetener? What are you going for? In the meantime, okay. willpower's popped in. Hello, willpower. Don't laugh. I'm not going to laugh at all. I'm going to stare cold-faced. Okay. At the screen. So. What is this? Do you have... Did you bring some orange blossom honey with you? I did, yes. No way! That's so cool! A little secret ingredients! 
Here, here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you do your mixing first. And then I'm actually super curious to have some, just a little bit. I wanna try, try a little bit of it. Okay. Dude, good call there, Jay Swizzle. Somehow all of our neurons were firing at the same time. I've been trying to like get out of the habit of like going to Dunkin' every day for my breakfast. Ooh, so you're getting a little creative on your own? I, uh, I, uh, I, I've been trying to like drink more tea and kombucha and stuff. Nice. Uh, Kombucha was never something I was really able to get into, mostly because at the time I was not a fan of like the kind of like pointedness that kombucha honestly tastes like. But since then I've drank vinegar on its own, specifically apple cider vinegar, uh, since my mom's thing. It's not mixing in. So the honey will actually, it will mix better in your drink if it's been turned into honey syrup first. And we can use this as an opportunity to do some of that. So, are you open to making some quick honey syrup? Uh, sure. Absolutely. Keep so, cool moments. Absolutely. So there's a milk frother. It's that black little handle on the right-hand side of the tackle box. I'm gonna grab a small glass from behind you, and we're gonna add honey into this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do the sciencey thing. So now that we have the milk frother, can you grab the scale that's on top of the sugar container? Let's make honey syrup the easy way. It's super easy, or at least it can be. I'm gonna turn on this, and feel free to add as much honey as you want to to this container, as much as you want to, from your honey container. Continue, 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 do, do, do go on. Froth that honey, says life. A lot of stirring, much stirring, much stirring, and much frothing. I will eventually see how many grams of honey we're putting on top of this. I don't know whether you have to honey measure honey in grams or whether you do that in milliliters because it's technically a liquid. Go, go ham on it. Go ham on it. Whatever you add to there, we're going to add equal parts water. If we're going to measure in grams, we're going to measure the water in milliliters. Then we're just going to stir it up a bunch and mix it with water. That should make it less viscous and able to actually go into the drink. Uh, we have about 20 here right now. So Nice round number. Indeed, 20. Actually, if you can add to 30, then we can put a whole ounce of liquid in there. It'll make the math even easier for us. But indeed, actually, life brings up a good point too. You can take honey and quite literally just like froth it up and you can make expensive whipped honey for free at home. And it's so easy. Shit. What do we got? 32 and a half. 32, that's okay. The viscosity of the honey is not on our side. So we're gonna add 30 milliliters of liquid which is gonna be about an ounce of water. Um, would you mind filling this with an ounce of water? The water's on your side. And then, get the frothing. This thing is honestly crooked, so it makes funny sounds when you turn it on. We'll see how, it, we'll see how it's going after we mix it with honey. Go for it! And now that we have equal parts in there, we're gonna see whether this works. It doesn't want to move. No way. I've actually never made honey syrup this way before, so this is an experiment. I'm gonna get it all nice and up in itself. It's spinning. There we go. We gotta get it at an angle. There we go. Who needs to do a lot of stirring when you've got a milk frother to do it for you? It's also completely bubbling it up. That's great. I'm gonna get it all stuck in there some more. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's, how's the cocktail going so far? It's going, it's going okay? We're getting some really nice and bubbled honey over here. This is that at-home kept technique. Technically, if we added heat, this would be even easier. It's going, it's going. We're all about patience. Patience for quality ingredients. This is also a learning process. I've heard so many things. How does this sound from everybody else's point of view? Oh my god, you had the honey on your finger! It's orange blossom, though. Alright, I'm gonna say that that is more or less stirred enough for the both of us. There is quite a bit of honey at the bottom, but let's see how this goes. Got some honey syrup for you. Bit of honey syrup for me. I poured myself way too much. I'll give you back some over here. And then I'll pour some over here. And then I'll pour That's some good. back. Okie dokie. Boop. Honestly, we got most of that honey. Well, oh, that smells great. That's good. Put that in there. 
And then I'll give us a little stir again. We'll agitate it a little bit. Now that we got some sweetener in there. A little secret ingredient. How's the stream going so far, says Will? Things are going well. We are making Whalen Smashes, which is basically just whiskey, ginger, mint, and lemon. And we added a little bit of honey to it to sweeten things up. Somehow, our guest Imi Chow has honey on them, which is really cool. For the pursuit of better drinking. Amen. Woo! Shall we try it again? Still smells gingery. Mmm. That was really good. Not that fair. that honey addition is a great, great idea. I will absolutely add that to the recipe after the fact because that makes everything a lot more balanced. Instead of being more or less just whiskey ginger in your face, I'm feeling that this now with the added sweetness is a little more balanced. I can really get some of the mint in there too now. There's a sort of like, like airiness to the mint that exists on like the back of my tongue and combined with the flavors of the honey now, that is an incredibly pleasant combination. It's really easy to drink too. That's great. What an excellent combination. This is the power of teamwork. Speaking of sweetener, it says life in Croydon. There are two drinks from the office that Michael makes that uses just alcohol and Splenda. One, I know the drink of at least one of those. Oh my God. I, it's not called the one of everything, right? Might be worth trying. I don't think they'd be good at LMA. One of them is in my books. I don't, I don't think it's called the one of everything. Maybe it is called the one of everything. But I do know what drinks you're talking about, but I can't seem to remember them by name. Not unless you're familiar with The Office. I don't even watch The Office. The only reason I'm even vaguely familiar was because my boss likes to make a lot of references to it, and it pops up on the internet every once in a while. One of everything. Oh, okay. It is that one. Great. And then there's the other one with the Splenda. Well, that's great. So now that we've got our whale and smashes, we can proceed with the rest of things. Mimi Chow, now that you're hanging here as a part of our live studio audience, what would you like to do? It is your choice. Um, what do I do in terms of... You can like hang around and watch the game. If you want, you could do some of the gaming and I can take his back seat and do some, I guess, commentary. Ugh. Shudder at the thought of it. Totally, totally your choice. At the very least, I'm very happy that we actually had a guest here as well. It's been a hot minute since we actually had any other guest behind Orange this bar, Vajuska. aside from my dearest. Isn't that like Orange Vodka Juice? Is that is that is not that that just screwdriver? a screwdriver? Yeah, is that that sounds like a screwdriver? Orange Vodka Juice cup. Maybe like stack it on top of each other. Maybe that's the implication. I'm not familiar with those. If you happen to have those recipes, feel free to share them. Like. By all means, if you if you somehow figure out how to layer that, I'm sure there's a way. I'm sure there's a way to do it. All right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a bit of cleanup over here and put things into the buckets, and then we'll proceed into the next portion of our stream. The other part. This is the pre-show cocktail. Now I guess we're doing the post-show, post-cocktail show, which is great. May I give this honey back to you? This is an excellent addition with the orange blossoms too. Very, very good. Coolio! All right, if everybody's ready, I'm gonna pop back to the game side of things and play some Undertale this evening. I need to do a little bit of post setup because we're in an area right now at the beginning of Hotland where there is no good music. So I decided to save everyone's eardrums this time yet again. I promise you it's better than what we had so let me do a little bit of changing around here. Is the music still going? The music is still going. Let me turn on our Undertale soundtrack and turn off the other parts because that's just how it'll be. And let's proceed to the game, the game side of things. Let's put ourselves back here, back to Undertale. That's what we're playing this evening. It's all Undertale time. Great, excellent, excellent. Amy Chow, thank you very much for joining us on the bar side of things. We've got two beautiful Whalen smashes, and if you want the recipe, you can you can follow that little directive that's very down at the bottom. This is wonderful. Who's your friend? Oh, I completely forgot to introduce her to, to Willpower. This is our friend Amy Chow, one of the other bartenders with an X that frequent the bar with an X around here, who also mixes up drinks and stuff. No public no public recipes original to her to her repertoire just yet, but 
Wait, the remember that, uh, that one oh, thing I did. made for the garden store? Yes! Yes! There was, um... Actually, you helped me come up with the Garnet Star cocktail wind up being the showstopper with the cherry hearing, actually. It was Imi Chow who helped source the ingredients for that and also come up with the whole joke of the cherry hearing, red herring part of the, the Garnet Star showstopper cocktail from Paper Mario, actually. You're right. You should take absolutely full credit for all that. And, to be fair, some of the cocktails that I'll be presenting next week, namely the Alfie's cocktail, had some inspiration from some of Imi Chow's input. There's always, you could call it like ghostwriting almost. It's not really ghostwriting because it's not like I don't have my hands like <laughs> deeply in the pot over here, but we bartenders with X's, I'm still trying to figure out the literary way of referring to ourselves, do a lot of crosstalk, and there's definitely not just two or three of us. We're all bartenders. We're all mixoxologies. Anyways. That's as far as I'm going with that reference. Let me also take a little thing over here. So we can actually see what we're drinking. This is a very pretty drink this time around. This is a very, very cool aesthetic to it. It actually looked even cooler when it was not properly mixed. But, you know, that's just, that's just the name of the game. All right, y'all. So where did we last found ourselves? We, we last found ourselves fighting Undyne. Undyne is not quite dead. Um, she's been properly cooled off with a little bit of water. She was hanging over here by this little water fountain. Oh, hello there. I don't know who you are. How are you? Oh, K, 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 K. That's a one too many Ks, my guy. Two too many, actually. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. This seems to be the only water tank in all of the underground. I'll say, if at any point in time, Michao, you feel like when a, a voice just bubbles up inside of you, you can catch a character. You can voice them if you'd like. Actually, you can voice characters if you'd like to. Wait, 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 wait. This is all improv. This is all improv if we want to. I honestly wasn't expecting to have guests, so we're gonna make it work. This is what we do. Your trash can scares me. Though the trash can likes to greet passersby. Let's see. Let's go see what Alphys is up to in the lab. Or maybe we should talk to these royal guards. Would you like to be a royal guard? <laughs> oh. Well, this one has nothing to say whatsoever. Sorry, Undyne. Like, like, told us that there was totally a human in the area. I love the way that your night body is just jiggling and pulsating and whatnot. You know, to represent me forgetting where the camera is and trying to read the words. No problem. Right there on the got preview it. screen, there you got it. So if you scooch in, you should be able to see your head pop up somewhere in this little corner over here. If you're so comfortable to. Ooh. So, like, us royal guards are blocking off the elevators for now. Yeah. Even if the elevators aren't working anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undyne. No, very, very nice night job. Thank you. Very nice night job. I, I honestly don't know. So you're, you're Horn Knight, and I'll be Batwing's Knight? Because that kind of seems like the distinguishing factor between the two of them. Very cool. The one kind of looks like antlers. It kind of does look like antlers. This is Alfie's la or Technically, I haven't confirmed. Hey, we haven't met Alfie's yet. I'm on TV. I'm on TV. It's you? It's me. It's us. It's the conglomeration of all of us. It's too dark to see near the walls. Oh, okay. Oh. What about this computer? It's too dark to see near the walls. Okay, then. It's too dark to see any old thing around here. Oh! <laughs> Why, hello there. Uh. Oh. My god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon! Hi there, my name's Cameron. I haven't showered, I'm barely dressed, it's all messy and... <laughs> um... <laughs> Hiya. I'm Dr. Alphys. This is so I'm, precious. I'm Ascorp's royal scientist. I, I'm Cameron, I'm the human who fell from the top of Mount Epon. <laughs> But, uh, I, I'm not one of the bad guys. And I assure you, I'm not either. <laughs> Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um... You've been watching me? You knew I was in the ruins? Been observing your journey through my console. How dare you! It's okay. I like being watched. 
your fights, your friendships, everything. Uh, technically no fighting. I haven't killed anybody yet. I was originally gonna stop you, but... And you shouldn't, because I'm a peacemaker. Watching someone on screen really makes you hurt for them. <laughs> it's because I'm the main character of the story, obviously. So, uh... Now I want to help you. And I want to help you too by being your friend and making sure that you and Undyne get to do the smashy smash. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I'm sure that that is a characteristic of you to use. I know way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. This is a very advantageous piece of knowledge to have. Mm hmm Well, actually, um, there's just a... Issue. I assure you, I'm very handy with issues. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Oh my god, I know that guy. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. He looks good naked. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Porn star, I believe, is the right word you're looking for. I love it. <laughs> anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments. Like breast implants? Like, um, anti-human anti combat features? I would have preferred the former, actually. <laughs> of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided uh -huh. I have to remove those features. Of course, and you certainly did. Unfortunately, I made a teensy mistake while well, Doing. You turned so. them into super anti-human weapons. And, um... Now we're going to stop a whole killing machine with the rest of human blood? That's a question?! <laughs> uh-huh! But, um... Hopefully we won't run into him. Cue the robot! Right? I knew queuing the robot was a bad hear idea. Something? I think I did. Like, like, crushing metal feet coming through the walls, perhaps? Oh no. It's him! It's finally him! Oh. Oh, yes! Koi Man? Welcome, beauties! Oh my lord. Here's Johnny! <laughs> To today's quiz show! Hi there, Metaton. Oh boy! I can already tell it's gonna be a great show! Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestants! I'm the contestant, hi. Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. That's pretty easy, I guess. Or you die! Oh, oh dear. Great. Metaton attacks. At least we got this really awesome Metal Crusher music. That's pretty good. By the way, if 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 you would like to be on the camera, you have to be over here a little. Bit. But no pressure. It is just merely a reminder. Can you guys at least hear me? Yeah. Yeah. Let me let me double check. Say something. Uh, testing. Oh yeah. Three? Oh yeah. You're great. Okay. Let me move it even farther over here. There we go. Okay. Perfection! Metaton attacks! I am going to do my best to not get killed. Check, cry. <laughs> <laughs> Screaming is against the rules. What? <laughs> Let's start with an easy one! Oh, hey there. What's the prize for answering correct words? Um, uh, mercy. mercy, 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 more questions? All right, it sounds like you get it. The quiz show continues. Hello there. Can I keep crying, actually? Can I mercy you? Mercy you? Here is your terrific prize! What do I get? What's the king's full name? Right, because it's additional questions. Uh, Asgore Dreamer? Give me that one. Correct! What a terrific answer! The quiz show continues, mercilessly. Alfies, do you have nothing to say about your creation? Enough about you! Let's talk about me! Hi there. What are robots made of? Hopes and dreams, metal and magic. Um, what are you, what are you doing, Alfie's? Uh, uh, Sips of snails, uh, sugar and spice, metal and magic. Too easy for you, Hunt. Apparently, spare me. Here is another easy one for you. Two trains, train A and train B, simultaneously to depart station A and station B, station A and station B are 252 uh, miles, uh, five miles uh, apart, apart from uh, each other. Train A is music. Yeah, 124 miles and the of this station A. Both trains both departed at 10 a.m. and it is now 10 o'clock. Two, three. How much longer until the trains pass each other? Wrong, 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 wrong. I don't know what's going on. 
Did you know the answer to that question? Don't count on your victory! Counting? How many flies are in this jar? Uh, there's gotta be at least 55. No, nope, completely utterly wrong! Okay. Let's play memory game! <laughs> what monster is this? It's a froggit! No, wait, it's a final froggit! No, it's definitely a froggit. What? It's... that's not even fair. The quiz show continues. How am I dying? I don't want to die! Wait, but can you get this one? I don't think I can. Would you smooch a ghost? Heck yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah. Great answer! I love it! I may or may not have fornicated with Nabs to look off screen. You what? Fornication? It's... I know what Okay, it is. okay, Aren't okay. My wife would not appreciate it. Spare! Here's a simple one. How many letters in the word Metaton? Three... Oh my goodness gracious. How about this one? Of course that was easy for you. Uh... The show continues. How am I not dead yet? Spare me. Time to break out the big guns. Literally, in the dating simulation video game, Mew Mew Kissy Cutie, what is Mew Mew's favorite feud? Hi there, Alphys. I don't want to steal ice cream. Ice cream for those. But Snow Blue and she's the only one who wants it. It's one of my favorite parts of the game because it's actually a very powerful message about friendship. Something about snails? I heard something about snails over there. Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? <laughs> You should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does El Dr. Alfie's have a crush on? <laughs> it's most definitely Undine. See, Alfie's had told you it was obvious. <laughs> Even the human figured it out. Yes, she scrawls her name on margins of her notes. She names programming variables after her. She even writes stories of them together. <laughs> Ellipses, sharing a domestic life a together. Box. Probability of crush, oh 101%. Margin of error, really? 1%. That's where the 1% of the 100 comes from. Well, 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 aren't you feeling great? With Dr. Alfie's helping you, this show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. I'm blasting off again. I didn't realize that Metaton could do that. Uh, oh, that was certainly something. Sips drink disappointingly. What a time that was. Hey, but look at this dog kibble. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. Unless. Ooh. Wait, the fridge. wait. Okay, yes, yes. Let, let me g give you my fo phone number. This feels oddly forward for somebody who I literally just met. And then maybe if you need help, I could. Could, could, I don't know what, pretend to be my fake mother number two? Oh, where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! Please stop insulting my sense in technology. It doesn't even have texting. You know what? Screw you two. You have an absolute dinosaur of a computer. I am a dinosaur. Oh, wait a second, please. A bunch of sound effects. I personally don't think that those uh, sounds should be coming out of a phone, but here, I upgraded it for you. It can do texting, items, it's got a keychain. It's giving me alerts for the streams of a Cam Roxon with an X on a random Discord channel with a plaid background and a actually tastefully polka dot plaid party hat. I don't understand. I even signed you up for the underground Stepper One social network. Facebook? Now we're officially friends. <laughs> or is it Blue Sky now? <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom. Don't trip and fall when you get there. Oh, goodness, that sounded like it hurt. What's in the fridge? The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles? Yes. I got the instant noodles. Instantaneous! Noodles that can be consumed instantaneously! It's a computer! It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Interesting. It's still the same computer, and it's still accessing Snowden. This is a cool little figure. It's a beat-up figurine of a female human with cat ears! 
Is it Mad Mew Mew? Trash can. Garbage can. But it's pretty cute. No, you, trash can. You're pretty cute. By the way, Life, I did not miss your comment. I see that the one of everything is equal parts scotch absinthe, rum gin, vermouth, triple sec, and two packs of Splenda. It looks like it's served in an 8 to 10 ounce paper cup. I actually have one of my books around here is from a guy named Nick Fish Fisher, a.k.a. Cocktail Chemistry, and I believe he gives a recipe for something like that. Yellow feet are tapping just beyond the door. Oh, that must be the Elfie's bathroom. It's a bathroom sign. Of course! And that's the light switch, which goes nowhere. What's over here? Oh, hello. That sounds scary. I'd rather stay inside, actually. Oh, no. Nope, What's upstairs? Nope, nope. What's up here? Scientific books. They seem very dusty. Green books. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. Sure. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. <laughs> it's Gundam. <laughs> this doesn't strike you as very accurate. VHS's and DVDs of various cartoons. How do you know what a VHS is, little person? They are all labeled human history. Naturally. All these books are labeled human history. I'll keep reading. You look inside a book, it's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. That sounds sexy. That sounds like Food Wars. It kind of might be Food Wars. All these books are labeled human history. You look inside a book. It's a comic book. A hideous android is running to school with toast in its mouth. Seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Yandere simulator? No, that's like every anime book. Pink goop drips from this strange machine. Pink goop drips from the other side of this strange machine too. That looks like Mad Mew Mew. Looks like Alphys' work table. Seems dusty. And a picture of a thing. Night and night, dearest. Night -night. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats. Thank you, my dear. My dearest says goodnight. My dearest actually says to leave the chat right now, and if you're on her side, you will. A single clean dress is in the closet. There are letters from many monsters in here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. Interesting. That's an aquarium? It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. Is there not something cool to be found up here, like this giant ass ice cube? An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed unfolds in an extremely easy to draw box. <laughs> incredible. And then a poster for Metaton. It's a promo poster for Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, Thank you for making my dreams come true. Incredible. That robot's got quite the personality. And you can tell because he wears it on his screen. That's beautiful. It's a very beautiful drink. Do you think- Oh, is Alfie's not in the bathroom anymore? Oh, wait, 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 wait a minute. Nobody in there. Oh, I, I cannot enter the hole. The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide. Interesting. I thought surely, thought surely there'd be something to do on there. Alfie's updated status. Just realized I didn't watch Undying- Oh, wait, 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 this is Alfie's! This is you! Updating your status! I didn't watch Undying fight the human. Interesting. Is that on the internet? Oh, okay. Another status update from Alfie's. Well, I know. I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. About was spelled with only three letters. Oh goodness, another one? For now, I gotta, I gotta call up the human and guide them. I'm about to get a call from Alfie's. Probably. Oh, it's the core. Yo. Hello there. Vulcan. I fill my waters with vulcanicity. How you doing? Criticize? Hug? I am low on health here. Wait. I'm gonna... I'm gonna die. Wait, I wanna get out of here. Wait, I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die. I'm out of here. Wait! Oh shit! I can't go the opposite direction! I wanna save. I wanna save first. I just realized I did not save. Oh. Don't get me wrong, I would love to go through all those Alfie's cutscenes and stuff again, but we got it. We got, we got progress to make around here. I'm gonna go talk to the sexy giant robot. Who said sexy? I didn't say sexy. You said sexy. It's great stuff around here. It's gonna be wonderful. I wonder if, Al you know, Alfie's is not standing in front of her computer anymore, which seems to imply that she's not watching me as of right now. That's that seems to make sense. I'm I think at least. Anyways. Onwards. Now that we're all filled up on health, I'm more than happy to go fight small volcani. Which is plural for volcanoes. I could actually be wrong about that. To be perfectly fair. 
could be very, very wrong about that. But I don't know who I'm hurting by that incorrectness. So I think we'll be okay. And come to think of it, Alfie said that this phone has text now. So if I look at my cell phone, Toriel's phone, Papyrus's phone, dimensional box A and B? Oh! I can access an inventory via the upgrades of this phone. What's in the second dimensional box? Nothing! I could put some dog residue in there. We'll save it for later. You never know when you might need a little bit of dog residue. Now let's go fight some uh, uh, small little creatures. Okay, they're on a... Alfie's updated her status. Go call them in a minute. Okay, sure, sure. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold my phone. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Oh, fight time! Sunderplane gets in the way. Not on purpose or anything, obviously. It's because you're a Sundure. Sunderplane. Sunderplane? I'm gonna flirt with you. You tell Sunderplane that you like its taste in movies and books. It's because I do. It's not because I'm lying to you or anything. Uh, you sicko. Sicko? What's wrong? Why, why would you call it sick? What's so sick about that? You know what's really sick? Trying to assault people with flat planes. It just seems... It's a little on the nose for us Americans. Flirt! You tell Sunderplane that it has cute winglets! That's because you do. Although the perspective on your body and your wings are just a little off, but I'm totally into it. I like your hairdo. Anthony Woodrow says, salutations. Anyone here? Only me. And the live studio audience. Say hi, live studio audience! Hi, live studio audience. The live studio audience says, hi, live studio audience. Huh? You sicko! Why? Why am I saying- You're literally bombing me! What is up with that? Sort of plane accidentally bumps you with its wing. Uh, yeah, and at least a couple of small bombs. Should I approach? I get close to Sunderplane, plane, but not too close. Ah, uh, human? Yes, that's me. Oh, I like- Oh, oh, but close! Close, but not too close! I understand! I understand! I can hear- Wow, look at that. They're blushing. Do I- Oh! Oh! That, that's all I needed. I just needed to get close, but not too close. Hello to you, Anthony Woodroffy! I don't know if you pronounce the E at the very end of your name, but if in fact you do, I've something done something very correct today. Anyways, continue with the core. The other medium song is an absolute slapper. One who slaps. Anyways, I should be getting a call from Undy uh, Undyne. <laughs> Alfie is at any moment. Save point. The whooshing sound of steam and cogs. It fills us all with determination. Save, please. I didn't realize that I just had to get over here, but I probably would have died. Alfie's updated her status yet again. My goodness. I hate using this phone. I don't want to do this. What's with all those uh, wacky emoticons? I don't even know what she's trying to say here. If I go up and I go that way. Nope, I definitely want to go this way. Emoticons. Continue. Hot steam venting action! Doesn't get better than this. <laughs> Alfie's updated status. Oh my god, I've had my claw over the last, the last two shades for the last five minutes. Oh, you do have claws. That's the implication. Anthony says, my name is Jaden and my dad's name is Anthony. Ah, the connection doth be made. I'm still confused about where the Woodroff comes from. Unless you'd like to dox yourself and admit that it's your family name. But don't worry. I'm not pressuring you to do so. I'll just say for canon purposes that your in real life name is actually Anthony oh Not So Wood. I'm just gonna call her. Because that would be the opposite of rough. The thought of human social interaction fills you with procrastination. It does. Hello there, pie rope. You're literally a piece of rope on fire. It's so great. Um, I love that so much. <laughs> cool down. No, heat up, dude. Go get him. I'm gonna gaslight you. I crank up the thermostat! Pyrope begins to get... excited. Hot, hot, hotter, hotter! I don't really like that. What does the orange mean? I don't know what the orange means. Oh, oh! I have to go right through the orange. I've learned something new today. Run into fire and the fire don't hurt. Pyrope wants more heat. Would you mind going turning up the heat for us? How? You crank up the thermostat, it's super hot! Pyrup looks satisfied. Hot, hot, hotter, hotter! I'm gonna die. Oh my god! What? That was absolutely disappointing. 
Orange equals run. No, I think orange you glad you never heard from me again. I died. Bye, y'all. Night, everybody. Oh my god, but if the live streamer is gone, who is playing the game? It's a ghost. It's it's most definitely a ghost. Hello. Hello there. I'm just kidding. I'm back. Blue means stay still. Oh, but we learned that lesson already, Anthony. Thank you very much. Oh. Well, it seems that somebody called my phone. Huh. Very interesting. Hello. Ring! Uh, Hello? Uh, hi, so, the blue lasers. Alfies, is that you? Yeah. Uh, what's uh, up? I mean, I mean... Alf is here. Yeah, I already asked what your name Hi. was. I've got caller ID, bro. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. Yeah, we've already been over that concept. Uh, orange ones, um, you have to be moving and they... You couldn't have told me that before the creature threw the orange uh, fire at me! I'm going through a moment, okay? It's okay, honestly. I was probably being a little too hard on you. Please go on. Uh, they won't, uh, move through those ones. I'm supposed to move through the orange ones. Yes. Is that because you're telling me to? Because the game taught me to? Or because Anthony's telling me to? Uh... Bye. Well, well clearly, Alfie's doesn't know who you are. That's, um... Scary. Alfie's updated her status. Oh my god, Did she really? Oh, I've been chill like that since something called me to ask about the weather. The weather... <laughs> Weather one who wins. So just run through the. Okay. Why would you move at a time like this, Alfie's? Wait, there's no weather down here. Why don't you call me? Maybe it's because she likes you or something. That'd be so cool. There we go. Anthony says, I'm gonna eat. What are you eating, though? Brad! Popping in with a subscription at a time. What the frick was that? Yay, so many months. There's like 19 of those. Let's see, how does that make you now in sub months? One and seven equals one plus seven, which means eight, which means you are too young to drive still. Laser button. It's a switch. Press it. The lasers were deactivated. Just call me Jaden, please. No problem, eh, Jaden. Absolutely. Go on, get your foods. Alvia says. My God, I forgot to tell them where to go. You actually capitalized the T and the H in the word them. Just a typo. Just a small typo. It's okay. We're all capable of making mistakes. And then Alfie's... Right now. The C and the U is also capitalized. And so is the P and the I and the C in pick. Wait, there's only two lowercase letters in that whole post. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters all over it. Oh, it's a joke. That's so great. I'm nine, not eight. Well, excuse me. At this bar, we only accept patrons over the age of 21 or the age of majority in your local jurisdiction. But don't let that stop you from having a great time. Ring-a-ding-ding! Alpha's uh, uh, here. Okie dokie. The, the northern door will stay locked until you... Until I what? solve the puzzles on the right and left. Oh, I forgot you're on my phone. Hello there. On the left? I, I think you should... Go to the right first. I'm not sure if I trust you with that. This button! There we go. That's the way that we're going. Yo, yo. What's going on? Alfie's says. Whoa. What's up? Oh. I forgot to read that. How y'all doing here? The way to work is blocked, so I had time to catch Metaton's show on my phone. The special effects are amazing today. That human almost looked real. I'm literally standing right behind you. Metaton? Yeah, he's the most popular star in the underground. This fan club probably has at least two. Nah, like three dozen members. Very encouraging. Guess what? I went to five islands. I haven't even been to one island. Hey, dude. What the heck? Would you like to voice this one? The door leading to the area is closed, so I tried the puzzle. Is that how that works? Metaton, I hardly know Teton. Brad, get out of here. But I I'm kept kidding. running out of ammo, and it kept restarting. Please stay. And, and my two co-workers won't help. It's like, they, they don't even want to go to work. You're literally ahead of the game. <laughs> Shoot it with the gun. Get it? 
Nice, dude! Excellent! Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. Shoot it. Shoot it with fire. Shoot it with fire. Shoot the opposing... Oh. 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 Open Gundam style? Uh. Uh. I shoot one by... Oh! <coughs> now it's all making sense. Five Islands is actually a water park. Dude, I didn't know that there was a, a water park called Five Islands. Tell me more. Do they have water slides? That's the easy question. And I'd be very shocked if the answer's no. H hello? Somebody on the phone? Hello? Alpha's here. No, I thought it's Vsauce Michael here. The, that blue laser seems totally impassable. It's okay. I was just trying to do a joke on you. You seem incredibly um, scared right now. Just feel free to calm down. But, but, but. As the royal scientist, I ha have some tricks up my sleeve. As the royal scientist, or at least one who claims to be, I believe you. I'll uh, hack into the uh, Hotland Laser database and take it out. Okie dokie, why would you have to hack into your own database? Oh, she hung up. <coughs> Yo, it totally worked! Go, go, go. That was awesome! Hello, person. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Have you been trapped on this other side this entire time? Now we're free, we can... Well, uh, I guess we'll just keep standing here. Are you both punks from your local school? Not to say that you're punks or anything. We were hanging out when suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules. They've got to cancel school over this. For your sake, I hope they do. Oh, laser time! I know this one. Very fun ones. That's Jaden answering the question about the water slides. Have you heard of freezes? Freezes like, like icy freezes, like that they sell at 7-Eleven? I've heard of those freezes before, but, but potentially not the ones that you're referring to. Tell me more. Is a freeze, like in this case, is a freeze supposed to be a drink? I'm a guy who knows drinks, or at least claims to be. According to at least one source on the internet, I'm a really for real bartender. And, and technically, if you asked any of the patrons of my bar, they would technically agree with you. Yes, they are drinks, so they are the freezes! Brad says C-O-N-G-R-A-T-U-L-A-T-I-O-N-S. And for some reason, I cannot spell that. I'm sure it says something like congratulations or something. Whatever, I'll just explain it. I wonder what that status update is supposed to be. Oh. Hello? Uh... I think, um... Hey, about the puzzles on your the left and right. I thought they were on my right and left. They're a bit difficult to explain, but... I already did them already. Uh, you already solved them? Uh, yeah, bro. I've got at least one degree. Awesome! I'm also a child. Oh, that's when they hang up. Same old story. Nobody wants to get close to a child. There are freezies at five islands. They live in Trinidad. Ooh, that's cool. I've ne personally never been to Trinidad. I think there's been somebody who... No, 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 no. You might be the only person who has mentioned that they live in Trinidad. How is Trinidad? I'm assuming that it's a tropical place, but that's just because of what I've seen on the internet, and I can't believe everything that I see on the internet. But please, hold for a moment. I'm sure I have a very important call to take. What? Hey, ow. I'm sorry, that was indeed too loud into the microphone. Let me hold it like... It's kind of dark in there, isn't it? I think it's fine. Don't worry. I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. I'd really prefer if you stop hacking things. Hacking's been... Turn off, turn off, turn off, turn off, turn off. Oh, no. Uh, Alfie, what's happening? Oh, yes! Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premier cooking show! Cooking with a killer robot. Preheat your ovens, because we've got a very special recipe for you today! We're going to be making... a cake! My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients! Everyone give them a big hand! We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart! Okay. 
Sans has heard of my genocide, says Jaden. I, I have not killed anybody yet. What did I, what did, wait, what was I supposed to get? Sugar. Uh, oh, sugar. Uh, uh, here's sugar. You found the sugar. Okay. Uh, do I put them in the cake? No, I put them, okay, okay. You, you gather them all. Get them all. I, I found the milk. Okay, got some milk, got some milk, got some eggs. Cool. Um, 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 killer robot, what do I do next? Great job! Just put him in the middle of this counter. Perfect! Great job, beautiful! We've got all the ingredients we need to bake the cake! Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my! What a magnificent moment! How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. Is that a chainsaw? Ah! Human soul. Oh my lord. No, that's fine. No, that's, that's Nope. Oh. Um... Hello? Uh, uh, who, who is this? Whoa, I'm no, kind of, in the middle of something here. I don't, I don't really know what's going on here. Oh, Alfie's? Wait a second. Alfie's? Couldn't you make a... Uh... Couldn't like, you use a... Please give some sort of suggestion. Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? Like, instead of a human soul, maybe, uh... A substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? I'm gonna guess that's probably Metaton. Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? Vegan? Well, that's a brilliant idea, Alfie's! What a great special idea! Actually, I happen to have an option right but, here. But there's milk. MemDB brand, always convenient human soul flavor substitute. Forget about the milk, you crazy dinosaur. A can of which is just over on that counter, right over there. The floor's kind of clipping out. That's great. Hi, everybody. Hello, darling. Why don't you get it? I will try my best to. Got a bunch of people popping in on the YouTube side. Pacifist Run, he did. Hello, lol. Easy YT and Naruto. You are indeed Naruto. Um... And that is indeed a very, very tall counter. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So, better start climbing, beautiful. Um, climbing how? Oh, hold up a second. It's my girl. Yo. Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. I assure you there's plenty of time. I just don't <laughs> know how to do it yet. Unfortunately, I might have a plan. Okay, I believe you. When okay. I was upgrading your phone, I had a few features. Few features, you say? You see that huge button that says jetpack? Actually, I think it just says, um, flashlight. Watch this. Okay. Whoa, that is not a flashlight. Holy crap. That's the most powerful flashlight I've ever there. seen. What did you do? You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Well, I guess it does say jetpack, I suppose. Now, get up there. Here we go. Oh my goodness gracious. It's time for jetpack time? Cracker, cheese and cracker, cheese and cracker, cheese oh and my cracker, goodness. cheese and cracker. I, I don't want to get hit by the cheese and crackers. I, I see just the, oh, those are just eggs, I guess. Are they just eggs? Oh my, um, how? Uh, um. uh, uh, I can't, I can't, I can't. I don't know what to do in this scenario. Go in the gaps, you ninny. Oh, I can go beyond the thing. I had no idea that I could go beyond the thing. Try Delta Root after this? That's an excellent idea, Jaden. I've been listening to the music of both Undertale and Delta Rune for a while now, and the plan may or may not be involving Delta Rune. I don't know whether I'll do it now yet. I know the chapters three and four are supposedly coming out sometime within the next year, so I'm looking forward to it. And I can't be the only person looking forward to it. Oh my goodness. What is going on? There's too much flour. Oh, this is the hotel theme. We were just listening to this while we were making our smash. And those are definitely eggs. We made it. My, my! It seems you've bested me! But only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alphys! Oh, I loathe to think what would have happened to you without her! Well, toodles! Bye. Oh yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it! That, 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 that tracks. Hello? Wow, we, we did it. Uh, thank you. We, we really did it. I, I definitely Great would job not out have survived. There, team. Thank you so much, Alfie's. Oh, well, uh, anyway. Let's keep heading forward. I don't know if I really, oh, she hung up.
Interesting. Oh, look! More fire! An ominous structure looms in the distance. Doth it be the core? You're filled with determination. Magma chamber. Core view. It... You could say that with a view of the core, must be the core. Hello? To see the building in the distance? I'm gonna guess it's the core. That's the core! No shit, the Sherlock. Sorry, language. The source of all power for the underground. And yeah. your sarcasm. It converts geothermal What'd you energy. Say? Did I stutter? That hurts, but we move on. It converts geothermal energy into magical electricity by heat? Uh anyway, that's where we're going to go. We're gonna go into the thing that provides magical energy by converting thermal energy into something else? And my body's going in there? And the car is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. Well, who designed this system? Who knows? And from there, you can go home. Do, do I have to? Oh, she hung up again. To the core? To the core! This is actually a lot less epic than I thought it was going to be. R1, it stands for Recycle. Perchance. Elevator, click button, please select a location. How about Cancel? That's not a floor option. How about Left Floor 1? It goes sideways? I guess it does. Jaden asks, do I want some ahead of time spoilers? Jaden, I know everything about this game already, but feel free to go for it. This is me being ironically egotistical. That wink was weird. I should not be winking at children. Oh, hello. I take that back. Where am I? Seeing such a strange laboratory at a place like this. Wait, where'd the guards go? Muffet, hey, watch your mouth. That was interesting. Well, that's great. So I don't want to go in the. Oh, wait a minute. Oh! This is the left side of the lab. So that must mean that right floor two. I see. Little Ooh, Miss Muffet, who sat on her tuppet, eating her curds and whey. She decided to birth spiders, and that's when we found her having a wonderful bake sale. Hey, kid. What's up? Heat's flames, man. Hey, I'm Heat's flames, man. Remember my name. All right. Heat's, Heat's flames, man. I'm going to remember your name, Heat's flames, man. Yo, it's Sasanza Sansans. What's up, dude? Hey, buddy, what's up? Want to buy a hot dog? It's only 30G. Thanks, kid. Here's your dog. Yeah, dog. Apostrophe. Dog. Short for hot dog. I figured as much. Really tough bosses, Muffet, says Jaden. I believe it. LOL says LOL. <laughs> LOL, that's so ironic, LOL. I love hot dogs! Hey, isn't it weird there's snow on this guy's roof? Guess he's just too lazy to clean it off. Or maybe that's a part of the joke. Tell Stevan. Is that all you have to say for yourself? Tell Stevan. I hmm. promise you, that's all that needs to be said. Interesting. Apparently, Jaden hasn't gotten set. past Muffet. <gasps> is this genocide mode or is this pacifist mode? What does Alfie's want? What do you want? Oh, it's a status update. Dinner with the girlfriend. But you have what? a girlfriend? It's a picture of a cat girl figurine next to a bowl of instant noodles. <laughs> okay, can you hear me, chat? Can yeah, you yeah. Hear me, chat? <laughs> it's so it's funny because because can somebody in chat explain to me why that's funny? And I need at least fourth grade level reading words, or else it's not going to click with my overeducated brain. Cool skeleton ninety five posted a picture. Is that Papyrus? Are we posting hot pics? Here's me and my cool friend! It's a picture of Papyrus flexing in front of a mirror. He's wearing sunglasses. Giant muscular biceps are pasted onto his arms. The biceps are also wearing sunglasses. Huh. Pyro bounds towards me. This guy wants it hot. 
Did I get the spider cider? I actually ate the spider cider in favor of concealing, con con keeping the spider donut. Might have to kill him then. I crank up the thermostat. Pirate begins to get excited. Oh yeah. Hot, hot, hotter. Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do here. I develop an extra strategy for things such as this by letting myself get even more hots. More hots. More hots. Oh, I did not do that correctly. There we go. And the room is sweltering. Get out of here. I might have to kill them. Yes? Yes? Is it the donut? Wait, is it the donut or the cider that I need? Oh! Lol, cool. Oh, this is Alfie's. Yes? Uh, cool scotch and pug. That's a joke, right? I know, I think it's pretty cool. The only joke here is how strong my muscles are! Says Cool Skeleton 95, who I assume must be Papyrus. Naps to Block 22 has sent me a frame request. Accept the request? Absolutely, I love that dude! We may have kissed off screen. Seems to have already rejected itself. Mm. Oh. oh. There's an apron lying on the ground. Will you take it? Yes. I got the stained apron. And what does the stained apron do for me? Snowman piece, ballet suit, stained oh. apron. Hot dog? Question mark? I thought it was a apostrophe dog. Stained apron? Stained apron. Armor, defense 11. Heals 1 HP every other turn. I love that because the one thing that I am really, really bad at doing is defending myself. You equipped to the apron. There's a secret. Go up. Up we go. Whoa. Whoa. What? Whoa. I have never trusted a random stranger from the internet before, Jaden, but to this moment onward, I will trust every word that you say. You have an encyclopedic knowledge of Undertale. Please guide me in our journey. Art club, meet here. Next meeting, October 10th, 8 p.m. Damn it, I'm late. Nah, you're just hella early. I like the cacti. All the way up, all the way up, all the way up. It's as far as it goes, bro. Thanks, now I'm stuck. Art club, art club. Huh, very, very interesting. LOL now pops in with a chat saying LOL with, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm gonna say that's at least a dozen. Change it to that time. Oh, no, no, no. That requires too much effort on my part. Oh my god, somebody's calling me. Hello. Uh, uh, hi. It's hi there. It's not It's def- oh. That's always uh, kind of, uh, timing based. Oh, interesting. You see those switches over there? Yeah, the red ones? Y you'll have to press all- of them within three seconds. Well, good thing I have the power of my stand, Star Platinum. I'll try to help you with the, with them. Seriously, you didn't get the anime reference? Oh, she hung up. Maybe I made her uncomfortable. How bizarre. There's a secret boss there. Oh, is that where you find the wrong enemy? Um, I don't remember what the enemy's name is. Oh, I totally screwed it up. Oh my god, I totally screwed it up. Wait, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Are you kidding me, Alfie's? What's up? Okay, now press the third button. Are you kidding me, Alfie's? Uh, hey, looks like you only need to press two of them. You're right, I was definitely too hard on you. She hung up. Huh. Oh, Brad said like an hour ago that sunglasses are cool. It's true, they are. It's called Cesar. I to help with the puzzle. Ooh, interesting. Oh my goodness. Hey, uh, Hey! Hi. I'm going to the bathroom, so I'll be MIA for a bit. I'll miss you. I'm, I'm sure you can handle this puzzle yourself. I'll miss you! I don't know how to do puzzles! She hung up on me. Oh, great. I was just being facetious. Uh oh. Oh! Oh! oh. The numbers change. I understand that. Ah! Oh. Oh? Oh? Wait, ah. Uh. Oh? Wait a minute. If I just go back the other direction. Oh, but now that's the wrong way. I have to go that way. Oh, wait a second. If I go back this way. Nope, and then I go back the other way. And I go this way. Huh. There's a sw there's switches, so I have to click switch. Oh, okay. 
No, that was wrong. Oh, I know what I gotta do. I know what we gots to do. We just gotta do the exact same thing we just did. Oh, maybe that reset things. Okay. 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 This way. Then this way. That didn't help. Maybe if I do this way. So now let's face in the opposite direction. I don't click on the switch. Then I do that. Then I do that. Then I do this. Then I do this. Then I do this. Oh. So I need to be facing that direction. And then that one. And then this one. So I need to face the other direction. Which means I need to go this way. And then go that way. And then not click on the button. And come all the way back around. What goes around comes back around. Or at least that's what... Oh, wait a minute. Aha! Uh -huh. Ah! That didn't work at all. Because I need to be on another stage completely. Interesting. Can I just, like, run? No, that don't work at all. Interesting. Hey, want even more spoilers? I mean, if you're offering them, who am I to tell somebody to stop talking? That was sarcasm. Click button. Click button, do thing. Click button, go other direction. Click button, do thing. Click button, do thing. Honestly, what if I just like go over here, right? And then I go this way. And then I do that again. Oh wait, maybe I do want that direction. Hold up a second. I have a plan. I have a plan. It's called perseverance and determination. Nope, that didn't work at all. I don't like this plan. What is the plan? What is the plan? What's the plan? I don't know what the plan is. Interesting. So now I gotta do my thinky brain for this. Click button. Now it swaps. I need that to get to the other side. It'd be useful if the buttons were not completely in sync with each other. If I go up here, I don't see any changes there. Now I can't go that way. True pacifist is a final boss called Azriel. May I try? Tag out! Tag out, tag out, tag out! Okay. Woo! We got our special guest, Emi Chow. Mm -hmm. We're both very educated individuals, so I think between the two of us, we can both accomplish at least something here. Actually, speaking of Azrael, we're currently coming up with cocktail recipes inspired by all the different characters from Undertale. I'll share with you a secret. I think that the Azriel cocktail should have cereal in it. Bar with an and an, oh, bar with an Emi Chowks. That's a good one, Brad. Bar with an Emi Chow, Emi Chowks. This is interesting. Full name Azriel Dreamer, god of hyperdeath. Did you know that Azriel Dreamer's name, if you spell it a different way, is serial murderer? Ah, wait. Did you do it? Hold on. Maybe. It's possible that without your presence here this evening, Shoot. I'd be totally out of luck. Wait, okay. Okay. I'm into it. So you can press the button... To, like, reset things, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, I guess you can press that button as much as you want to, technically. Oh! What if we go back to the first button and we just swap the orientation before we even jump inside? Okay, now it won't let me go over there. Right. Yeah, you just gotta invert it on your way there. <sighs> yeah, Angel. Yeah, Angel. Tell us how to win the game. Because <laughs> we're both struggling. <laughs> These puzzles are hard. I mean, it is the core. It's literally guiding the core, so. Guarding the core. So that actually makes a lot of sense. Ah, uh, wait. Okay. One. Two. Wait. Damn it. Oh man. So we gotta do the invert. We gotta do the invert while it's there. So we have to get there while it's in this position right here. So if you go... No, okay. If you go down and then across. Like left? Like left. Okay. And then up. Then up. And then left. 
left. Okay, and then go down, all the way back, then up. Hold on, let me think for a second. If we swap over, it becomes that. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, no, 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 you can't go that way. Because if you bounce, it swaps. Bounce, it swaps. Bounce, it swaps. Wait a minute. Wait, go up. Okay, don't press the button. Okay. Go, go on the steam vent. Got it. Okay, I'm double checking my logic. One. Two. Okay, go down. Oh, you can't go down. That's the thing. Oh. Okay, I guess go up then. Because it blocks you from going that way. But there's nothing Whoa, wait, 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 okay. What if you, okay, go back down. Now go down again. Okay. So down. Oh, but that doesn't make sense though. Okay, across, left. You sure we're going up? All right. Up and then uh, right. I'm gonna see what happens. No. That didn't work. Because there's an even, so long as there's an even number of switches, it will not swap all the way. So if we go down, and then off to the right. Oh, but then we can't get to the inside. And then we click, what? Dude, I'm so stumped, I'm gonna look this up. This is wild. Undertale, core, steam, jump, puzzle. Hotland puzzle. Are there any cuss words allowed in chat? Oh yeah, fucking go for it, dude. Hit number two, go for it. Wait, Angel, actually, we're gonna let chat come in clutch for this one. So now we'll just vibe with the music. Okay. Or just what keep you trying got, rampantly. Angel? Just keep trying rampantly. What if we, if we click button first and then jump, what do happen? No, then it's back to, no, oh, wait a minute. Click button again, and then left? And then we're here. And it'll only let us go yeah. right enough. Work that body, says Brad. Shoulder squeezes. Feel free to participate only if you'd like to. <sighs> kinda, kinda squeeze our shoulders like this. Chicken winning next. Up, okay. up, 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 up. Well, now we gotta go down, Jaden. Let's go down! Okay, so the middle one is the one you use to invert, okay? The way you invert is by jumping on it and jumping back down. Oh, wait a minute! Oh, oh, okay, 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 wait a minute, okay. I got this now. Amy Chow, go down. Then go down again. Wait for it, wait for it. Hold on, you click up and then it, go up. And then back down again. Then back down again. Back then down. left. Left now? Yeah. Then up. Then up again. Then up again. And then to the left. Oh my goodness! Angel, that was such a good hint. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Jaden, don't think I didn't see you also trying in the YouTube chat. I appreciate all of this. That was so good! Nice job. Oh my god! What does this woman Mew want? Mew 2 is better than Mew Mew 1? Wait, Mad Mew Mew is actually inspired by a character that Alphys is a fan of. Which I believe is only a Switch exclusive boss. Cool! I learned something new. Thank you all! Thank you both Jaden and Angel for coming in with the uh, the double help there. Nice. How do I... Uh, enter. Or X. There we go. Well, that's a joke, right? Maybe. The determination fills me with glee. Knowing the mouse might one day hack the computerized safe and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Nice. Bad opinion zone. Bad opinion zone only. Wait, is there an actual mouse in that hole? I can hear the squeaking. There is definitely a mouse in that hole. The computerized? There's a piece of cheese inside this computerized laser safe, but how do we know there's even cheese in there? The lasers have melted the edges of the cheese. It's stuck to the table. Beautiful. Alfies? Oh my god. Don't they get it ruined? Or don't they get ruined Mew Mew's entire character arc? Does Mew Mew have a really compelling character arc? Okay. Wrong answers only. Oh? Bye Mew Mew 2 of you. Okay, I'm in it. Mew Mew Kissy Kissy 2 is neither kissy nor cutie. It's trash, 
Zero stars. That's a little rough, don't you think, Alvis? I literally can't figure out how to type responses on this phone. Tap out. Props to Amy Chow and Angel and Jared and the rest of the world at large who did this first. By the power of our friendship. How you doing over there? It's possible that it was all the really good spaghetti from earlier. Hey, you stop! Um, who might you be? Which Royal Knight are you? We've like received an anonymous tip about a human wearing a striped shirt. They told us they were wandering around Hotland right now. I know, sounds scary, huh? Well, just stay chill. We'll bring you someplace safe, okay? I I'm a human. Huh? What is it, bro? The shirt they're wearing? Like, what about it? I got a bow tie on, honestly. Bro, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Bummer, that is, like, Mega embarrassing. We like actually totally have to kill you and stuff. These guys are totally surfer dudes. Royal Guards! What's up, dude? Which one were you again? I was the Batwings. Yo, what's up, guards? RG wanted to. Oh, okay, okay. Red, green. I get it. I get it. I get it. Clean armor? I want to clean your armor. You attempt to touch RG01's armor, your hands slip off. Like, hands off the merch, team attack. Oh, goodness. Okay, that's, that's actually. Honestly, that's. That's not too scary, honestly. O1 stands guard. Huh. Jaden's using the bathroom. Don't worry, Jaden. Me too. I'm so sorry. I'll clean your armor. You clean RG1's armor. It's cooling dirt begins to wash away. Getting warmer. I'm sorry, what? What the hell is that supposed to mean? Oh, I see. Oh, oh. You're in hot land. Oh, 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 warmer. Oh, I get it. It wasn't... It wasn't me... It wasn't him commenting on my advance. The bar with the next moderation staff would like you to know Cam is not actually using the bathroom. Unless... O2, watch my movements. Yes, thank you, mods. Thank you very much. Here's a free drink for you, mods. Here. This fever tree tonic... Wa this fever tree ginger beer is for you, Brad. And for all the folks at home who know how to spell serendipity. I guess I'll whisper? You tell RG01 to be honest with his feelings. Like what? I don't get it. Heh. <laughs> I, I, I don't know really. Oh my goodness. Hi there. Um, hi. Hi. I can just hang up. That felt like a really opportune spot. Serendipity. Oh, well, Angel, I can't prove that you weren't using autocorrect. Serendipity. I mean, technically you're right, Brad. O1 is polishing his face. Yeah, called you right out. That's okay, you did get a drink too. Here you go. Here's the essence of the glass that the ginger beer is in. It's glass. Please don't put it in your mouth. Um, I don't really... Do I, do I continue asking you about your feelings, Mara? Do I, do I clean your armor still? I attempt to touch. Your hands slip off again? Oh my goodness. Jaden's back. Did you... Was your, <laughs> was your bathroom break just as fun as mine was? Oh my goodness, no! Oh, oh dear, oh dear, my goodness gracious. Oh, one stands guard. Uh, what do I do? I don't know what I'm doing! Um, check your feelings. Tell honest with your feelings. What? Oh, you're so confused. I am also equally confused. Ha ah, ah, ha! You're oh, on to something. Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho! Okay, 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 what do you think? Consumption! Dude, the perfect time! Um, where's the thing? Where's the thing? Where's the thing? Alright. What do you think? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's all up there. Sweat pours from O2's armor. Oh, I should keep should keep cleaning your armor. I clean armor. It's cooling dirt begins to wash away again. Getting warmer. Even warmer? Oh, oh, that's me polishing the armor! Wait! I it all makes sense now. Can't take it! Armor too hot! Oh my lord, look at those abs. Much better. RG1 looks bothered by something. <laughs> oh! Be honest with your feelings. You tell RG1 to be honest with his feelings. I, I, I. Oh, this is, this is, oh my goodness. Wait a minute. Oh, this is good. Oh, this is very oh, good. Oh, oh, this is very good. Oh, oh my goodness. Dude. I, I can't. 
I, I can't take this anymore. Not, not like this. Like, O2. I like, I like, like you, bro, bro. Like the way you fight, the way you talk. I love doing team attacks with you. I love standing here with you, comma, bouncing and waving our weapons and sync ellipses. O2. I like, I want to stay like this forever. Uh, uh, I, I mean, um, psych, <laughs> gotcha, bro. <laughs> oh. oh, what? Yeah, bro. Do you want to? I do, bro. Get some ice cream. After this? S sir, dude. <laughs> I went on a tour looking at each other happily. Jaden, why would you bring up the beauty that is has been at a, a hotel at a time like this? Can't you see we're trying to have a moment? Uh, have I heard of has been hotel? Oh, yes. I've watched the whole thing. Have you watched has been hotel yet? I haven't watched it entirely yet, but I... No spoilers. No spoilers. It's really good. Oh, what did this- what does this chick want? Yo. Oops, wait. How's the human doing? I'm doing just fine. Thanks for asking the internet. Oh, I love the, uh, the mm -hmm. screensaver. Oh. Oh, thank you. Top My... 10 shows that make you forget to do your frickin' job. <laughs> Top 10 shows that make you forget to do- Oh! <laughs> it's as a part of the Mew Mew, Mad Mew Mew 2 <laughs> review. I've been in that kind of situation with a girl before. <gasps> Jaden, personal business on stream. Drama! Oh, I know exactly what I'm getting myself into. Yo, bitch, it's cooking time. Okay, I'm back. Is it not, in fact, cooking time? Another dark room, huh? Please don't tell me we're cooking again. Don't worry. I'm still oh, worried. My hacking skills got things covered. Are you gonna turn the lights on again? Oh. I'm starting to hate my job. Are you serious? Are you serious? Oh, yes! Good evening, beauties and gentle beauties! This is Metaton reporting live from MTT News. An interesting situation has arisen in Eastern Hotland. Fortunately, our correspondent is out there reporting live. Brave correspondent, please find something noteworthy to report. Our 10 wonderful viewers are waiting for you! And I can count them all on two hands. One, two, three, four, five. I've already lost count. Um, here's a basketball. Basketball's a blast, isn't it, darling? Too bad you can't play with these balls. Line. They're MTT brand fashion basketballs for wearing, not for playing, not for fondling, not for pleasuring. You can't get rich and famous like moi without beautifying a few orbs. Report this one. R report? Um, I I'll look around a little bit more. Woohoo! No school due to puzzles! I like this dog, though. How about that present? How about... Is that the Necronomicon? Ooh la la! This video game you found is dynamite! Though I don't make an appearance in it until three-fourths in, but I like that! Appearing from the heavens like mana, slaking the audience's hunger for gorgeous robots! Ooh, that's Metaton! That's pretty cool, but I think I'll look around for something even more. It's literally Metaton. What is this? Oh no! That movie script! How... How'd that get there? It's a super juicy sneak preview of my latest guaranteed not to bomb film. Metaton the movie. XXVIII. Ellipses. Starring... Metaton. I've heard that like other films. It consists mostly of a single four-hour shot of rose petals showering on my reclining body. Ooh, but that's not confirmed! You wouldn't... <clears throat> spoil my movie for everyone with a promotional story, would you? Metaton, you clearly have no idea what I'm packing in my own basketballs. Attention viewers! Jaden is playing Roblox! And don't we find that sexy? No, we don't! He's claimed he's nine years old. We have to keep ourselves within the realm of our local jurisdictional laws. 
In other news, a movie script! Oh my, and it looks like it's for my latest film! Let's not keep them waiting. Let's open it up and get the scoop. It's a bomb. What's that inside the script? That ticking sound? That lit fuse? Oh my! Looks like I was wrong about the movie! We definitely have a box office bomb on our hands, and it's about to blast you to bits! But don't get too excited! You haven't even seen the rest of the room yet! I'm sorry? Oh, there- oh. Oh my! <laughs> Seems everything in this area is actually a bomb! That dog's a bomb! That basketball's a bomb! Even my words are... Oh my god. Nope, couldn't do anything about that. Brave correspondent. If you don't defuse all of these bombs, this big bomb will blow you to smithereens in two minutes. Then you won't be reporting live any longer. Life says I might have to download Roblox. Been itching to play a tycoon game. That was one of my favorite... Th Actually, my favorite game on Roblox once upon a time was the Space Explorers game. How terrible, how disturbing. Our nine viewers are going to love watching this because one of them dropped off in the middle of the news segments. Come on, dude. Be cool. He probably doesn't appreciate spoilers. Good luck, darling. Defusing the bomb. Ring, ring, ring. Un seriously, at a time like this, Alfie's? Uh, don't worry. I installed a bomb diffusing program on your phone. Huh? Use the diffuse option when the bomb's in the diffuse zone. Okay, and I'll now, try. Go get them. I'm gonna try go getting them. It's a dog. Hi, there, there, there. In the diffuse zone. A diffuse. Uh, act. Wait, wait for it. Diffuse. Dog diffused. Excellente. Right, oh my god, up. she's still on the hey, phone. Do I am I familiar with the song Two Days in College? The bomb left next. Okie dokie, I am not familiar with this song. Bottom left, bottom left, bottom left, bottom left. Oh, hi there. Oh, hi there. Oh, it's the Oh. Oh, got it. Oh, I see what this is going. Got it. Diffusion failed. No, aim for the diffuse zone. I'll try my bestest. I'm, I'm trying to. Got him! Got the bomb! Oh my goodness. I don't know. Uh hey, is it is a present. Okay, almost there. Got it. Okay, gotta get out of here. Gotta get out of here quickly. 59 seconds remain to defuse all the bombs. Oh, there's a basketball bomb. I've done all this before. Listen to it, it's really good. Feel free to send a link to that. I am going to forget. Or if anybody in the Twitch side of things uses the suggest command, I will actually not forget. Got it. Okay. Got it. Okay. Great job. Head for center. Abusing oh, it was an EM field, I believe. To the center we go! Oh, what is this? Oh my goodness, what is that? Is it also a diffuse the extremely agile glass bomb? Bomb diffused! Oh my goodness! What the heck? Well done, darling! You've deactivated all the bombs! If you didn't deactivate them, the big bomb would have exploded in two minutes. Now it won't explode in two minutes. Instead, it'll explode in two, two seconds. Goodbye, darling. No, 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 no. Wait, it's literally, nothing's happening. It's been um, two, it's been two seconds. My life flashing before my eyes. Ah. It seems the bomb isn't going off. I have an important call. That's because while you were monologuing, I. Oh, we're what, diffusing the bomb? I, I, I change. Uh huh, yeah, yeah. Oh no! You activated the bomb with your hacking skills! Yeah, that's what I did. Impressive! Curses! It seems I've been foiled again! Curse you, human! Curse you, Dr. Alfie's, for helping so much! But I don't curse my eight wonderful viewers for tuning in because another one of you dropped off. It's okay. I understand. Until next time, darling! Oh, wow. We really showed him, huh? That we did, Doctor. Uh, hey, I know it's kind of weird at first. You're still kind of weird, but I like that. But I really think I'm getting more, uh, more... Uh-huh. Well, more confident about guiding you. You're doing great. Honestly, so, validation. Don't worry about the big the dumb robot. Yeah, don't worry about the big dumb robot. Nice job, doctor. Excellence. Uh, I'll 
protect you from him. And if he will came down to it, we could just turn... Um, never mind. What was that last part? Later. She hung up. I kind of want to touch the bomb. Evidently, you can't touch the bomb. Not in the way that I'd like to touch the bomb. Not like this. Who would really drop off a stream? Brad, you right. Want to hear the lyrics? Oh, come on. I'll listen to it in my free time, but thank you for offering. If I had to ask, what is your favorite part of the lyrics, though? Ring, ring. Oh, my goodness. Is it the doctor? It is! Um, I know it's even kind of quiet. I, I don't... Wait, have you not been hearing me this entire time? Has my microphone been off? Are you worried about meeting Aspor? No, I'm not worried about- Is the- is the- oh. Well, don't worry, okay? Uh-huh. Yeah, cause that's helpful. The, the king is a really nice guy. Can you not hear me, Alfies? I'm sure you can talk to him but well, with your human soul, you can pass through the barrier. Alfies, if you can hear me, say and spell serendipity. So, so don't worry, okay? Just, just serendipity! Fine, S-E-R-endipity. Oh, you can hear me. Oh, that was that's that's clever. That's really clever. Oh, she hung up. That was interesting. It was a bit, don't worry. It's just a bit. Yeah, it, it's just... Just, it's just a bit. It's just for the bit. We have to have. I have to have. I have to have like a uh, a disclaimer that pops up on the screen when it's just a bit. When it's just a bit. Please note that just a bit does not excuse my actions as a broadcaster. Please select a location. I've left never, floor three. I've never been to left floor three before. I'm intimately familiar with left floor one. Let's go to left floor three. Let's see where it finds us. I still find it hilarious you can go over and up. This is very funny. It's like that elevator from Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory. L3. That thing's literally holding on to the passageway, and I love it. Oh, yo. Oh, yo. Oh, yo. If I walk past her, can I just buy a donut? I, I'd like... Actually, I'd like some spider set. Uh... Uh, I don't get the muns. I, I don't got enough spider cider for that. Uh, I'll take it. Nope, can't get a donut. Where's my donut? I thought I had a donut. Is it not in my boxes? Oh no. I do not have a donut. Maybe we ate already during battle? Uh oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go do that thing where I get real determined for a hot second, and um, then I'm only gonna cry a little bit, and plead for mercy. That's that's kind of what happens. I'm gonna buy a shit ton of ice cream, at, and and items. I bought a bunch of hot dogs from Sands. That's that's pretty cool. Hot dogs. Sands is hot dogs. I did eat all the things. I totally ate all the things. Where's Sandsy boy? I need dogs. <laughs> I need dogs. I need the dogs. Was, was that in was that in um right area two or right area one? I think it was, it was in left. No. It, was it in the other one? The, uh, oh dear. Oh dear. I mean, we have a hot dog problem. Uh, uh, I have only one hot dog though. Oh, this one's not very good looking. There's no dogs over here. There's some determination. Oh goodness, Sans, where's the hot dog? Y'all have made me very afraid of Muffet. Y'all have made me very, very afraid of Muffet. Let's try left floor did number you two. Thing? I think we did. I definitely did, and I forgot what the consequences would be. Left floor two? There's dogs around here somewhere, and I've got money to spend on dogs. Who let the dogs out? Not me. Is over here. Having a spider donut inside your stomach fills you with determination. <laughs> it's true. It do. Oh, did I go to the wrong way again? Where the hell is Sans? Where's our boy? Where's our Sansy boy? You might have had to have gone one over. One over for from. the right. Oh, I need a Hotland map. Oh, maybe I gotta. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, what do we got? Select the location. It was not right floor two. It wasn't right floor what? Was it right floor one? It might have been. Might have been you right just floor have to one. Go over a bit. Just gonna go a little bit farther over. It's a shame you can't run in this game. 
can't run for my life from giant spider demons. Nope, can't do that. Sorry, guys. Can't be doing that kind of entertainment around here. Just doesn't work. Continue, continue. Must find the- whoops, hello, small little star in the sky. Oh, this was the cooking show. Did we find Saints after or before that? Oh! Thank you, kid! I like that little flag there. Where's my party horns? That's an excellent question. <laughs> oh, I dropped it. Would you like a party horn as well? And it won't let us go back over. Here you go. For our impending doom! <laughs> Is it working? We're gonna die. We're gonna die real hard. Maybe it was floor number two? Jaden, with your infinite knowledge of Undertale, please guide me to Sands. I must fill myself up on wiener dogs for the fight ahead. Oh my goodness. Wave that banner high, y'all. Please select the location. Was it right floor two? Am I gonna exhaust all of these options? Until I find what's up? Uh. Uh. Yo! Yo, that was Flame Seatsman! There's Sans! I remember! Hey, yo, I wanna buy a hot dog. I wanna buy a hot dog. Can I buy another hot dog? Can I buy another dog? I'd like another dog, please. Please tell me all of your hot dogs. I'm, I, I'm, I'm putting all my faith in you. You really got hot animals, don't you? Hey, I'm not judging. I'd be out of a job without folks like you. I'm going to use my super duper dimensional box cell phone and put the belly issues in there. I'm gonna put the put the put the cloudy glasses in there. There's a hot cat. There's uh what? <laughs> Can I buy some more dogs or cats? I honestly don't really care. Sans R2, thanks for the assist there, Jaden. It's only 30G. Cool. Here's the dog. Apostrophe, apostrophe dog. It's short for apostrophe dog, which is, in turn, short for... Hot hot dog dog? Hey buddy, what's up? Wanna buy a hot dog? It's only 30G. Another one? Okay. Careful. If you eat too many hot dogs, you'll probably get huge like me. Huge as in super popular, I mean. I'm practically a hot dog tycoon now. Thank you, Sans. Thank you for that. And thank you, Flame Seatsman, for always being there for us, even though I honestly didn't want you to be. But this is how we are. So left floor three was the top one, but I got a save point before there, so let's go to the... <laughs> I'm just filling myself up on wieners before the spider fight. Somehow in context, that feels appropriate. All right, you'll do great. I'm gonna do just fine. I'm gonna do just fine. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get whacked by a spider lady. And, and, and maybe you like it? I'm honestly not sure to be perfectly honest. Oh, it seems that I have a piece of mint. Tastes pretty good when it's smothered in whiskey smash. Hey, I'm just gonna walk past you. I, I ended up buying a donut. I, I, I didn't want to, but that girl, even though I told her no, she kept staring at me in this creepy way and licking her lips. No, now I'm out of cash. Can we talk to her? Can I just walk past her? No, we gotta do it at least once. We gotta fight the spider at least once. We gotta fight the- It looks like some sort of powerful bracelet. Wait, it's just a croissant. It's a spider donut! It looks more... rubbery than usual. Welcome to our parlor, dear. Are you interested in some spider pastries? All proceeds go to real spiders. No. Check out the webs to make a purchase. No thanks. Spider donut? No, that's fine. No thanks. That's fine. Check out the webs to make a purchase. I'm gonna try to buy it anyway. I'm gonna try to do it anyway. Spider cider? I, I didn't have enough gold. I, I still don't. Alrighty then. Quick clarification on party hat points. Uh, properly plaid party hats, kid? To be overtly specific. Oh? Hi, Alf is here. Yeah? This room is like the room we saw before. Okay, okay. There are two puzzles to the north and south. Okay, north and south. Gotcha, gotcha, puzzle puzzles. 
You have to solve them both to proceed. You got it, omniscient dragon lady. Uh, also, I'd like to say... Go for it. I don't really like giving away puzzle solutions. That's okay, we're really good at puzzles. We don't need help from anybody. Except but if for you need help, just call me, okay? Oh. Actually, wait. I have an idea. Could I have done that earlier? Let's be friends on Undernet. Okay. Is that a thing? Uh, you could just ping me when you need help. Sure, I can do that. I like to friend people on the internet. Um. Wait, we're already friends, aren't we? Did you did you program them into my phone? I signed you up, didn't I? Yeah, that's a referral code, right? Is that how that works? You've been reading my post the whole time. Yeah, yeah. Isn't that what you intended me to do? That's why you put things on the internet because you want people to read it, right? Well, I hope you agree with me about me and you too. I do. She hung up. Kid asks for clarification on voice modulation. The duration of the voice modulation is up to the interpretation of the broadcaster, which just so happens to be me. So, spend at your own risk. <laughs> Sorry, I'll check myself with that. It's puzzle time, baby. Oh, Sunderplane and the thing. Not because it's jealous Vulcan is paying attention to you. Sunderplane, I'm gonna get real close to you. <laughs> Don't make me work that body. Don't make me tempt you to make me work that body. I get too close. Not too close. Speed will help you dodge, <laughs> human. I did it. I did it. Speed! I am speed! I am speed! Vulcan is wiggling its, its weird rump. Get out of here, Sunderplane. Help healing magmas. Help healing magmas? Are there healing magmas? Is that a thing? Are there, are there healing magmas? There are no healing magmas! Vulcan reassures you, the plane turning tiny is like completely intentional. <laughs> it's great. Camera did what? Says kid. I think Cinderplane did that. Vulcan, criticize, hug. I feel like I want to encourage you. I tell Vulcan it's doing a great job. Its attacks become extreme. Ah, it does my best! I don't, I don't know. Whoa, dear! Wow, that's pretty scary. Wow, actually, that's not as scary as I thought. Vulcan parades around you proudly. Get out of here. I'm sorry. I love you. Wait, did Jaden say a little while ago that Muppets up ahead? Volcano lava can't melt steel beams. You have no proof for that statement. Oh, I did it. <laughs> did it. Nice. Got it. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hi. Hi there, puzzle kids. My fave meta time moment trademark, right when everybody looks the baddest, he poses dramatically. Like when he's on a cooking show and eggs don't turn out right? How about when she threatens the life of a human? My fave meta time moment when beats up heel turn villains. I even know if it's Durden was supposed to be a quiz show. Validated. Can't say that I agree. The killer robot thing kind of doesn't do it for me. It's just a little, a little confuzzling, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, Sam? You know what I'm saying, Sans? Sure you know what I'm saying, Sans. Y'all know what I'm saying, Sans. That's what it's all is. Sips. Unfortunately, the Sips doesn't work on the YouTube side. If you're on the YouTube side, Jaden, go into the description of the video, and that's where the Sips will be. I haven't yet, I apologize, I haven't yet gotten the bot to work on both sides yet. I apologize for that. Wait, but I wasn't, I wasn't even moving. Oh wait, I just... Oh, I see. I understand now. Wow, that was scary. I don't like that. Ring-a-ding. Hello? Oh my gosh. Hey. Hi there. This stuff doesn't have anything to do with guiding you. Okay. Okay. Is it about the lasers? Mm -hmm. Uh, hey. Would you want to watch a human TV show together? Only if that TV show is Dragon Ball Z Kai. I'm also open to other options. I've heard Jujutsu Kaisen's pretty good. It's called, um, Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. Is that by Akira Toriyama? Rest in peace. Yes! Uh, really? Yeah, yeah, I'm open to offering new concepts. It's so good. It's a, my favorite show. I believe you, and I really appreciate you for sharing your innermost passions with me, a total stranger, effectively. It's 
all about this human girl named Amy, which humans don't have to say she's all sense, but I'm about like adventure. You know, it's uh, you're so mad. Their friends like her despite her. She's really moved. Whoops, spoilers. Also, it sounds weird, but she has the power to control minds of anyone. She gets, she gets people and controls them to fix her problems. I don't remember anything about the kiss, I mean. But if she missed that kiss, then, then, uh, and, uh, uh, and uh, also, I mean, of course, eventually she realized I control people. Okay, well, I almost want the whole show up, but I, I think you really like it. Oh my god, what? We should watch it after you get through all this. Yes. Somebody's gonna have to summarize that for me. Please, child. I don't, I don't, I don't exactly know what I just agreed to. That was interesting. Um. Okay. Well done. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go shoot things. Oh, oh did I? Okay. Did I don't do it? Oh, it all makes sense now. Ha 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 ha! Science! I heard Mimi Kissy 2 was actually better. She sounds like Animal Crossing. Yo, kid, I bet if you had to talk in this chat, you probably wouldn't sound much different. Let's be honest here. We're all, we're all, um, Animal Crossing. Wait! Cactus! You stop to smell the flowers. And flowers, for me, happens to be... Mint, spelled backwards with a silent N. The Barbadex's newest mint plant. How did I know you were going to put your nose all up in it? Oh my goodness. I think I might have hurt her. I'm gonna let you go over there. Well done. Thank you, kid. Thank you. Um, so I've solved the puzzles, and I still fear for my life. So I'm gonna do that thing where I save scum. Because <laughs> I'm afraid of for my life. Do not bring up the donut. I value my life and don't really feel like doing puzzles again. Please select a location. How about number one? That well done was for the Animal Crossing impression, not you, Cameron. This is a stream where we swiftly correct things that are incorrect, like the broadcaster. Thank you very much, Kid Sandin, for holding us accountable for our own actions. Truly, it is the power of you and us combined that allows us to make this show run the way that it does. Please feel free to show your patronage by not offering any actual forms of monetary value, but merely offer your engagement in one of three different forms. You can either A, like and subscribe, two, like and subscribe, or three, don't. Brad wants you to join the Discord, though. We're all kind of lonely there. Actually, it's just me. Or for join, <laughs> for join the Discord. <laughs> for all of the above and Discord, obviously. Oh boy. But in all seriousness, on the Discord, we wound up sharing recipe stuff. We just kind of pal around and whatnot. Monetary value, kid. I specifically asked you not to monetary value. Now we have to do the thing again. Would you like a oh that's <laughs> a tassel? Oh, you had one. <laughs> I'm gonna keep that one on standby. Kid's kind of magnanimous. Uh, he winds up doing a lot of different things to show his support around here, whether that's in the form of snowmen or or beautiful little pride flags or corgi butts or the lack thereof. Oh. oh! Oh. Oh. The smell of cobwebs fills the air. I'm filled with determination. I'm gonna monetary value so hard. <laughs> Where's the kazoo? Where's the kazoo? Where is the kazoo? Oh, there's the kazoo. If you thought that party horns were cool, check this shit out. I know exactly what's happening next. It's kazoo time! <laughs> Would you like the voice of that? Uh, what kind? Did you hear what they just said? Oh, I heard what you said, all right. They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I'm the human in the striped shirt. I heard they hate spiders. I actually love spiders so much that I consume them. I heard that they love to stomp on them. That's just a lie. That's for the middies, kid.
Things are very slow around here. To tear their legs off. I did not try to tear the legs off of that spider. This is taking a while. I heard. Uh huh. I'm stuck. Hi there! That they're awfully stingy with their money. You were charging a literal arm and a leg, Muppet! <laughs> you think your taste is too refined for a pastry store? No! Dear. I think my taste is perfectly refined! Don't you know I'm a self proclaimed mixologist? <laughs> I disagree with that notion. Oh, okay. That, uh, clearly you heard what I was saying. Me on the fourth I think wall. your taste... Okay. ...is exactly what this next batch needs. Wait, actually, what do you mean by that statement? <laughs> in me or cats in me I'm gonna put an actual feline in my body oh, what the hell what the heck the HP is maxed out thank you so much oh my god Jaden with a compliment too at a time like this what is going on person who warned us about you who warned you about my presence what the oh, oh gee whiz holy duty oh I don't like this I don't like this at all oh my god Muffet does a synchronized dance with the other spiders and it looks something like this I don't even know what it's a reference to! Uh, here, here's more money. I'll give you all my money. Oh my god. Muffet reduces the attack yet again. Muffet's a lot of money for your soul. You're a very scary spider woman! Oh my goodness. How is this working so well? Muffet does a synchronized dance with the other spiders. All together now! I feel so threatened. Uh, more money. I empty my pockets, uh, but I don't have enough money. Muffet lowers the price. What a kind, kind soul. It's such a sweet smile. <laughs> what are you talking about? Are you talking about the freaking flower dude? I don't like the flower dude very much, not gonna lie, but is that a croissant? <laughs> what the heck? It smells like freshly baked cobwebs. You baking cobwebs? Wouldn't they- honestly, I'm not even gonna bother, um, questioning this. That's fine. Strange, but I swore I saw them in the shadows changing shape. Are you sure it wasn't a flower? Because I assure you it could very well be a flower. I would not be surprised in the least bit. 
I pour, get poured a cup of spiders. That actually sounds great. How did the spiders taste? Ugh. S tastes like corn on the... Cobweb. Cobweb. Nice pun. Excellent. Let's kill a spider, bitch. Or rather, let's not kill her specifically, actually. Oh, it's lunchtime, isn't it? I forgot to feed my pet. Are you sure about that? Oh, it's this one! Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. I know exactly what spider's coming next, dude. I know exactly what spider. Come in for a taste, you beautiful little muffin! <laughs> Hello, is this Amogus? No, sorry, you have Cameron on the phone. Amogus, you're gonna have to go to the next stream over. Oh my goodness, this actually ain't too bad. Not too bad. Muppet does a synchronized dance. He's still doing the dancing! Keep going. Struggle? I don't want to struggle. I just want to keep giving you money. I'll just keep giving you money. Well, that my spider clans can finally be reunited. Wait, there's an actual, like, canon to the spider clans? Oh, goodness gracious. This, this ain't, this ain't bad. This ain't bad. It could be worse. It could be a croissant. Muppet tidies up the web around you. Thank you. Uh, I don't have enough money for that one, sorry. I empty my pockets, but I still don't have enough money for Muffet. Haven't you heard? Spiders have been trapped in the ruins for generations. There had! There were spiders in the ruins! Spider clan, spider clans, does whatever a spider clans. Can they swing from the webs? Yes, they can. They literally created them. Whoops. Gotta stay in the middle for those ones. Croissant? Nope. Struggle. More money. I still don't have enough. They still... You gonna lower the price? Okay, that's good. That's good. They go under the door, Stone's Fatal Cold is impassable, though. Right, the impassable door, the one that I left my fake mother behind in. Don't worry, I am still scarred with the memories. Croissants, 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 croissants. Crescents, croissants, 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 crescents. I have beef with the French. That's why I'm so good. Oh, the spiders clap along with the music. Let's turn this shit up to 11. Oh, I didn't want to check you out. That's fine. It's gonna be fine. Get the money from your soul. We'll be able to rent them a heated limo. That's right. Heated limos sound pretty cool. That wasn't very good. I need... I need a hot dog. A hot dog. I ate the hot dog. My HP was maxed out. I'm gonna keep eating more hot dogs. All the leftovers, we can have a nice vacation. Ooh. Here are your presents. Croissants! No, 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 Jaden, you're supposed to say congrats. Oh, that actually sounds really cool. Not gonna lie, that actually sounds very pleasant for all of Spider Clan time. That sounds very, very pleasant. I hope for the bet. Honestly, I hope for the benefit of all of the Spider Clan, because that's what a bake sale is for, really. I still don't have enough to pay the bills. Oh my gosh. Time for dinner, isn't it? You're not actually planning on eating me, are you? Consuming a human soul and having enough power to go beyond the barrier. Whoops, I didn't mess up that one. I messed that one up pretty good. Hello! This could spare the end for our intrepid adventurers. Oh my god. Oh my goodness gracious! You're still alive? I am still alive! Hey guys! <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> yes? Oh my pet. Looks like it's time for dessert. I don't know what that's supposed. Oh, oh, what it? Oh, huh? Oh. A telegram from the spiders in the ruins. Yeah, I I bought stuff. What? They're saying that they saw you. And yeah, I bought a spider donut, and I bought your spider cider. I love the pun, you by the way. You're really passionate about spiders. Hell yeah, dude. Oh my, this has been all been a big mis misunderstanding. Surely the misunderstanding is on my part, madame. I thought you were someone that hated spiders. Not now, I don't. The person who asked for that soul. Uh huh. They must have met a different human in a striped shirt. Uh huh. Yep. Sorry for all the trouble. Yeah. I'll make it up to you. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh -huh. You can come back here anytime and for no charge at all. Can I at least have a spider donut? I want to oh, share right. it with my pals. Let you play with my pet again. Sure. I want to give donuts to all my new friends, including Lol and Jaden and the other person who popped in for a hot second. You all are appreciated here. <laughs> Just kidding. 
You are an evil soul. I'll spare you now. Oh, you will? Muffet is sparing you. <laughs> that was fun. See yeah. you again, dearie. Uh huh. Yeah, what's up? Not feeling well, and the, uh, the boss is soon. I... No kidding. Okay, no problem, no problem. Y'all, let me ch take a small, small brief repast for a moment. I need to go say goodbye to our guest that has decided to come around here. For those of you who don't know, Emmy Chow is one of the other bartenders with an X here, here at the bar with an X, and we love it when she comes around, and I love it even more so when she decides to share the spotlight with me. So I'm going to go say goodbye to Emmy Chow for a hot second. Please. If we can have a round of applause, that would be greatly appreciated. Intentional. Alrighty, y'all. Let's continue. Somehow we made it through the Muffet. And I think it was all because of the power of friendship or something like that. It's a poster from Metaton's. Pure dumb luck. It could be pure dumb luck, too. It's a poster from Metaton's latest stage performance. A tragic tale of two star crossed lovers kept apart by the tides of fate. Looks like it's almost time for the performance. Looks like it is indeed. Indeed. We have a couple of lovely emotes coming in from Brad for the love. Danella love and Brad. Dude, those emotes look all so alike. Oh my god, they're so good! I love those. I love it when folks come in here and share their emotes. Oh my goodness. Oh, that human. Is it Metaton in a dress? Could it be? It's Metaton in a dress. My one true love! Ta 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 Metaton, my sweet, come hither to me. Oh, my love, please run away, Monster King forbids your stay. Humans must live far apart, even if it breaks my heart. They'll put you in the dungeon, it'll suck. <laughs> And then you'll die a lot Really sad You're gonna die Cry, cry, cry Oh, so sad it's happening I appreciate your hand on my head, it's very reassuring So sad so sad that you're going to the dungeon. Well, toodles. <laughs> oh dear. Daniels and Martha Motes are maybe the same person who's great at that. Ooh, love this little FF6 opera montage. Oh no, whatever shall I do? My love's been cast away into the dungeon. A dungeon with a puzzle so dastardly, my paramour will surely perish. Oh, heaven's mercy. The horrible colored tile maze. Oh, right. I okay, I just All good? I think so. Excellent. Bye, Amy Chow. Bye. 
It has its own sadistic function. For example, a green tile sounds a noise and then you must fight a monster. Red tiles will... Uh, actually, wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? That's right. You remember all the rules, don't you? Great. Then I won't waste your time repeating them. Oh, and you'd better hurry. Because if you don't get through in 30 seconds, you'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. <laughs> My poor love. Oh, I'm so filled with grief. I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. Oh my god! Oh my love! No, that's falling down. Now in the tears, we all will drown. Colored tiles, make them a fool. If only they still knew the rules. Oh my god, I can't go that way. Am I trapped? Have I been trapped? I can't go anywhere. Wait, I can't go anywhere. Oh my god. Uh-oh. Ooh, I'm so sorry. You're out of time. <laughs> I've died. Here comes the flames, darling. I'm gonna die. This is, nope. They're closing in. I'm still afraid. Getting closer. Oh my. Uh, any minute now. Somebody's gonna hack the system. Somebody hack the system. I'm getting a call on my cellular phone, which it seems that I've left on the table. Oh my goodness. Jaden saying, hey Cam, watch free tasty skin. 6K sub special BFDI for a spook. I, I have total trust in you, Jaden. I must watch it. Watch out. I'll save you. I'm hacking into the firewall right now. Oh no. How could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys! Ugh. That... That's right! Come on, Metatod! Give up already! You'll never be able to defeat us! Not as long as we work together! Your puzzle's over! Now go home and leave us alone! Puzzle? Over? Alphys, darling... What are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound, then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me. Time to fight a metal robot. The power of friendship has solved the puzzle and doom. Hi, Annie. You've come in at just the right time. I'm gonna yell and scream a bit. You yell. Nothing happened. This is it, darling. Say goodbye! Ring-a-ling? <laughs> is that your phone? You better answer it. I'm already doing so. Hey, this seems bad, but don't worry! There's one last thing I installed on your phone. You see that yellow button? Go to this phone's act menu and press it! Your phone's act menu is glowing. O on the phone it is. Metaton. Yellow. <laughs> oh, little Abe and Annie. Hi, y'all. It's Medita time. You press the yellow button. The phone is resonating with Metaton's presence. Oh my goodness. Kara says another live. No. The actual Kara is actually watching us fight. I am just a lowly frisk, Your Honor. I'm not killing anybody yet. I promise. Oh, that yellow glow. What does it do? Um, excuse me? <gasps> Yellow mode! Now press C! <laughs> I can shoot bullets now. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, you've defeated me! How could this be? You were stronger than I thought, etc. Bye! Looks like you beat him. You did a really good job out there. All thanks to you! All thanks to you? Dude, I could not have done this without your awesome yellow soul-crushing upgrade. What? Oh no, I, I mean... You're the one doing everything cool! 
I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. Uh, uh, hey, th this might sound strange, but can, can I tell you something? Before I met you, I didn't, didn't really, I, I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a t total screw-up. Like, like, I couldn't do anything without, without ending up letting everyone down. Uh, but, but, guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So, thanks for letting me help you. Uh, anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past MTT Resort. Uh, come on, let's finish this! Let's finish this! Brad says we'll have to do a stream union for the other folks at the bar with an X. Indeed, y'all can continue to be friends. Car said, I hope Sans doesn't invade here too. He's even going on Brazilian live streams. <laughs> Sans says, it's easy with my tricks that I learned to be my bone to my bones. <laughs> <laughs> Sans isn't funny anymore. This is a bit. I love this. Yo, it's Nice Cream Dude. Hey, it's you again. Business is excellent here. These two fellows bought all my ice cream. I've actually sold out of everything. Sorry. Wait, I've still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? Can't buy smiles. Can't do that. Brad just says they need to go back to Andre, Andre Hem. Dude, Brad, you told me about Andre Hem and I've walked by it twice now and I really want to go inside. Oh my goodness. Hey, Sans. But if you're... here... then... Who's that in chat? Interesting. Jaden says, I'm sorry. Goodbye. No problem, Jaden. The fact that you even graced our presence for as long as you did is greatly appreciated. Thanks for popping in. This is a regular wall. I need the lamb hat, and you're absolutely right, Brad. Hey, heard you were going to the cooler. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Yeah. Yeah, ab absolutely. Absolutely. Great. Thanks for treating me. Oh. It's on my dollar? Over here. I know a shortcut. Lead the way. I thought that was just an ordinary wall over there. Oh. Well, here we are. So, your journey is almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, but oh. Though, maybe sometimes it's better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drink, friends. At least a small audience of the size of three or more. Is what you have to do really worth it? <sighs> ah, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. <sighs> hey, let me tell you a story. So, I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit out there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door. It's perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. So one day, I'm knocking them out, like usual. I knock on the door and say, knock-knock. And suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who's there? So naturally, I respond. Dishes. Dishes who? Dishes a very bad joke. <laughs> then she just howls with laughter. <laughs> like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So I keep them coming. And she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock. Nice aim. Who's there? Oh, lady. Oh, lady who? Oh, I didn't know you could yodel. Wow. What a woman. Needless to say, this woman was extremely good. We kept telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Papyrus gets kind of cranky without his best time story. But she told me to come by again. And so I did. Then I did again. And again. It's a thing now. Telling bad jokes to the door. It rules, dude. <sighs> 10 out of 10 jokes. 
You'll be impressed when I pull out this one. It's coming in at 11. <sighs> one day though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what was up. Then she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please promise me something? Watch over them, protect them, will you not? Now, I hate making promises. And this woman, I don't even know her name, but someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't say no to. You get what I'm saying? That promise I made to her? You know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything, buddy. You'd be dead where you stand. <sighs> hey, lighten up, bucko. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you so far? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Wink. Hey, what's that look supposed to mean? <laughs> am I wrong? Because I know I am. I can read your save file, bruh. <laughs> that's a nice ficus, dude. Well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Because someone really cares about you. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, playthrough number two, genocide run. That was mildly terrifying. Oh, yo, what are you doing? Hey, dude. As I, as I came in, I, I realized I forgot to make a reservation, but I didn't want to look like I messed up. So I, I keep I keep walking in anyway. So now I'm just kind of consuming dew off this ficus. It is a ficus. I thought it was. Can I have some dew too? It's a potted plant. It's still a potted plant. What about this one? The one that Sans looked at. It's a platoon of ficuses. Please do a genocide run. Oh, Annie, we are. We are going to do a true pacifist run. And then a genocide run. I love the gingerbread man with his ficus. Your interpretation of that gentleman being made of gingerbread is very amusing to me. It's a wall of fame full of quotes and photos from visiting celebrities. The food is to die for. Gorgeous style and fragrance. My face tastes beautiful. And these are all Metaton. Nice wall. Oh, yo, bro. Yo, look at this. Originally, we dug mazes with puzzles in order to foil human attacks. But now, building things winding and confusing. It's some awful tradition. You can't go. Ugh two feet without being up to your armpits and puzzles. It's true. And they're literally everywhere. And what about you, sir? I like the car the inside some man's made of swappable parts. That means we can shuffle the land at will. Boy, was today a fun day. I should love puzzle. And singular puzzle? Despite everything, it's still a potted plant. The last stream could be a marathon stream where we all watched the, <laughs> the last stream stream. <laughs> marathon genocide run. I am not doing that. I have to give myself time for cocktails. I'm the resort comedian. I'm very funny. People laugh at my jokes. Now, my son, he wants to be a comedian like his father. But his jokes aren't funny. He tells these awful puns. He's an embarrassment to our family. <laughs> That's not funny. Since his mother passed on, he couldn't stand living at home anymore, so he ran away. I haven't seen him since. I'm a terrible father. <laughs> That's not funny either. That's Snowdrake's father. Hey, Emily, I'm Cammy C. That's what they call me. You have to reserve a table to be here. You also need to reserve your chair, your silverware, your food, your... I'm a, I'm a go. Ooh. Mm. The thought that I will one day be completely 101% moist from that fountain and the relaxing atmosphere of this hotel fills me with determination. Sure, dog. I have no money. Welcome to the MJT Resort, Hotland's biggest apartment. Building turn hotel. 
Whether you're here for a night or still live here, MTT Resort prides itself on a great stay. Just passing through? Well, nice. MTT Resort prides itself on being passed through. That's great. Sharing an MTT's piss. I mean, I tried to fess up to pissing on stream earlier and Brad stopped me. Yes, we know. The elevator to the city is not working. Because of this incident, rooms are running at a special rate. 200 G a room. Interested? I would like to. That's not enough money. I gave it all to the spider people. Oh, a door to the core? That seems pretty cool. For legal reasons, the bar with the next staff would like you to know that he is totally wearing pants. It's true. Yeah, I'm not gonna be home tonight. Um, I think there's some cold pizza in my treasure hoard you can heat up. I just talked to you. X to doubt pants. I'm not wearing pants. I'm lying. Not wearing pants. I'm lying. I'm totally, I'm wearing pants. Wearing pants. Probably. You can't prove anything. This elevator goes straight to the capital, but it kind of stopped working. Dude, this music is so good. The hotel's doing its best to accommodate everybody stuck here. <laughs> Yo, oh my god, the clip command works! Yes! That's so cool, I think it actually worked. Holy crap! Did it get it right? Did it get it? Oh my god, oh my god, you guys gotta tell me if that actually worked. I was so hoping that one was gonna work. I fixed the bug. As a slime, I'm outraged. Good for you. Good for you, dog. Welcome to MTT Brandburger Emporium, home of the Glam Burger. Sparkle up your day. It tells me no clip is available? Oh. Maybe it's still processing. I don't know. I'm sorry. <laughs> It's against the rules to talk to customers who haven't bought anything. I literally, I have 2G. I, I can't buy anything. The URL is weird, but the little box is good. Oh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. I bet it's the ellipses, right? Oh wait, it's the apostrophe. I think there's an apostrophe at the end of it. Try removing the apostrophe. Oh, it did work. You just have to click on it. I'm gonna click it too. I'm gonna open it up in my tab. Apostrophe. Oh, it did work. You just click on it. Oh, that's just my stream. I'm gonna click the button. Open it up on my tab. Oh, there we go. Something went wrong. Clip missing. Wait. It's okay. I trust y'all to figure this out. I promise. I have absolute faith that y'all will figure this out. The extra double coats does it. Okay, okay. I'm gonna have to fix that. Can somebody... By, by the way, y'all, every time you suggest something, I do act upon that. So thank you. That works? Perfect. I will try to fix that. I don't know if I can. We'll make it work. Um, I'm gonna try to sell something. Why is this person trying to sell me something? This is a hamburger restaurant. I'm just trying to survive. The customer is always right. I, I literally can't do anything. I have no money. I'm sorry. Have a spectacular day. Sparktacular. Did I say spectacular? I'm wrong. That was weird. Peace out, dog. Peace out, dog. Suggest fix clip command to have the double quotes in chat. Slowly, slowly but surely, this whole this whole show that we're putting together is doing good. Great. Who's in door number one? Wah, room service. Got my CD? No. Yes. No, you don't. Okay. <laughs> I normally do that, but I was distracted too. I'm lying. It's a really catchy song. Evidently it is. It's locked from the inside. Okay. Oh, our room service. Got my cinnamon bun. Yes. No, you don't. You hear shuffling. Seems like you could put something under the door. I put a dog residue in front of the door. It slides underneath the door, as if pulled by a magnet. Two dog residues slowly slide back out from underneath the door. I hear shuffling. I'd like to put more dog residue in there, please. Oh my goodness. Suggest. Maybe a variant on suggest that timestamp, or it's just a tag nonsense like this and make your edits easier. So, I'd have to actually look into that. I was thinking of ways to allow people to mark the streams, but it's possible that... You know what? It's totally, it's totally possible. It's possible that the command can actually add clips. That could be really cool. It could add stream markers. That's an excellent idea, Brad. 
Wow. Slowly but surely, this whole this whole mess is coming together. Seems busy. Yeah, I get that. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Well then. There's clearly nothing for me to do here. So I'm gonna walk up. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Can I go in the elevator, actually? I think it's broken, right? The elevator is in use. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Brad for the win. I love that guy. Oh. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ding, 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 ding. Huh? Well, who are they? Nobody else is supposed supposed to be here. Go well. We can't worry about that now. I mean, if Alfie says that, I shouldn't worry about it. You could say that he's more than awesome. We've used that joke too many times. Or maybe we've used it just enough times. I don't know. We should ask the one whose namesake it uses. Oh, it's core time, baby! Oh, yeah? Okay, hold up. Alphys is calling. Ready? This is it. Take the elevator up to the top of the core. Alright. The elevator isn't working. <laughs> what? The elevator should be working. Uh, well then, go to the right and keep heading up. I'll try my best. I will try my best. Ring-a-ding! Alright, now just keep heading up. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, that pit isn't on my map. Oh, forget it! Let's try, uh, the left side! Click. Yay! Uh, left? Nope, not left. Okay. It's on fire. It's quite literally on fire. Oh my god. There's so much power here. Ring-a-ding! Okay, you should be able to make it through here. Uh. Uh, who are you? Wow, oh, watch out! Uh, I don't know who you are. Oh, it's magic time! Magic pops out of a hat! <laughs> Hi, Magic. I'm gonna stare. Where to stare? Corner orb? Chaser orb? Chaser orb. The unrelenting chaser orb was weakened by your glare. Baby! Hi. Oh my goodness. Oh, 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 whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, there's chaser orbs! Oh, they're literally... Oh, I see. I see they're chasing. Magic peers at you with strange eyes. I will also stare back at the corner orb. The intimidating corner orb was weakened by my glare. Kazam! Oh my goodness. Okay, that's actually... This is more or less fine, actually. Magic's orbs are incapacitated. That's it! That's all I needed to do! Peace out, Magic! Great, and I got gold again. That looks close. Uh, why are there so many monsters here? I mean, it's no problem, right? We've just gotta keep heading forward. <sighs> Click. I'm just gonna narrate the phone now. It's too annoying to take it up to my face a bunch. Oh, that's a laser. Ring-a-ding-ding! -ding. Looks like you can't proceed until you hit the switch! Uh, but, but those lasers will activate what do you do. Uh, it looks like they'll come in in this order. Orange, orange, blue. Got it? Move until the third one. You haven't used it nearly enough. Seriously, dude. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious! It appears that I'm receiving a call from Alfie's! Alfie's, is that you? Alfie's, you're not saying anything. Alfie's? Oh my god, are you hurt? Oh, I'm so sorry. I gave you the wrong number. Alfie's, are you actually talking to me on the phone? Oh my goodness! Everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine, okay? So let's just keep heading to the right. Click! But yet it still seems that there's somebody- RING! A crossroads? Uh, 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 to, to, try heading to the right! I'm gonna try my best to keep her sitting to the right. RING! Well, wait, no, I, I think you should uh, head up. I'm gonna keep her sitting to the right. Against my better judgment. It's a bunch of blue lasers! And a blue- RING! Ha, uh, ha! Uh, I guess this was the right way. M m more lasers. Okay, I- I won't mess around this time. I'll just deactivate the lasers and let you through. Uh, they're- they're not turning off. I can't turn them off! Uh, it's okay! I- I have this under control. I'm gonna turn off the power of the whole node. Then you can walk across! Alfie's, why are you laughing at me? 
Jaden's back. Hello, Jaden. I'm apparently in the midst of utter terror. Oh my god. <laughs> Click! Uh, the lasers are fine. The lasers are fine. The lasers are, the lasers are fine. The lasers are- Ring! Wait! Stop! The power, it did turn itself back on. How did you know? This is Elfie's talking. Oh my god, turning itself back on. Holy shit. D damn it. This isn't supposed to. I'm not supposed to move. They're blue. I- I'm gonna turn it off again. When it turns off, move a little, and then stop! Okay? Uh, you won't get hurt. Click. Moving a little, then stopping. Moving a little, then stopping. Moving a little, then stopping. Although I will not actually say who's on the end of, the end of this line, I'm sure you're very aware that you're experiencing the true live, live experience. So see, I've got everything under control. Everything's under control. Click. Wow. This is absolutely wild. It's only melting your brain a little bit. Ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. I wonder how it would sound if you put the phone up to the speaker and I hear myself talking back. Okay, you should, you should, I don't know, put the phone up and produce reverb, bitch. Alfie's doesn't mean it. This doesn't look anything like my app at all. Oh, I'm sorry, I, 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 uh, I, uh, Jaden, I'm on the phone right now. I have to go. Click. Oh my goodness, I can hear myself. I'm gonna put myself on speakerphone. Loud volumes. I don't think we can actually hear the stream. Little bit. Little bit. Little bit, little bit, little bit. This air is smell filled with the smell of ozone. Does it fill you with determination? I bet it does. I bet it does. Filling you with determination. Alfie's? Alfie's? I think I have to hang up the phone. <laughs> Lo and behold, wonderful things can happen on a live stream. I love you, Alfies! I just wanted to make Alfies feel good about herself, you know? So I said I love you. I don't really understand the repercussions of my actions, though, now that I think about it. There's a glam burger inside the trash can. Can I have that? Will I take it? I love garbage food. I'm carrying too much. Uh, oh, I have more dog residue. I've forgotten. I'll drop that. I'll take the glam burger. <laughs> oh my gosh. There's a glam burger inside the trash can. Thank you for entertaining your shenanigans. No problem, Alfies. Will you take it? I'll take the glam burger. You got the glam burger. Who was I talking to? Nobody will ever know. The fourth wall must not be broken. This way! Core time! It's time to solve a puzzle! And everything's gonna be just fine. Everything's gonna be just fine. Oh, puzzle, puzzle, puzzle. Oh, I got it. Wait, oh, I didn't want to do that! Oh, I exited out of it by accident. I didn't want to do that. What? Well, almost got it. Almost got it. Almost got it. Almost got it. I think I broke it. I broke it. Oh, I was doing so well the first time! <laughs> Go get him! Oh, this is it. This is it. This is totally it. There we go. Yes! I will absolutely breach this core. Also, the lights kind of look like tiki lights. That's really cool. I'm gonna write that. That's actually a really cool idea. The core lamps look like, like, tiki heads. Core lamps look like tiki heads. That's really cool, actually. I'm glad that everybody enjoyed that experience. That was actually hilarious. Usually the only per- Oh, this is where the ice done go. Oh, the ice cools off the core. That's what the dude in Snowden was doing. Core lamps, tiki made with ketchup in the middle. Tea core lamps, tiki made with ketchup in the middle. The air is filled with the smell of ozone. I love that for us. Let's go this way. Puzzle time? Nope. Puzzle time? Nope. Pu oh, almost puzzle time. Hello, bridge time! Who is it? A stigmatism draws near. Is it an stigmatism? Pick on. Challenge. Oh, I like your face, especially when you're smiling. I'm not gonna pick on you. You don't pick on astigmatism. Don't pick on me. 
I, I will try my best not to. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna do my best not to pick on astigmatism. Astigmatism doesn't care about fighting anymore. Oh, good. I didn't really I really didn't want to hurt you either. Cam, what's up, Jaden? How's it going, dude? Welcome back in again. Determination time! Behind this door must be the elevator to the King's Castle. I'm filled with determination. I am filled with determination. This is going great! But what- Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, yes. There you are, darling. It's time to have our little showdown. It's time to finally stop this malfunctioning robot. Not malfunction, reprogramming, get real, dude. This is, was all just a big show, an act, a live stream, where nothing's real and your feelings matter greatly. Alfie's has been playing you for a fool the whole time. As she watched you on the screen, she grew attracted, attached to your adventure. She desperately wanted to be a part of it, so she decided to insert herself into your story. She reactivated puzzles. She disabled elevators. She enlisted me to torment you. All so she could save you from dangers that didn't exist. All so you would think she's the great person that she is not. And now it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Alfie's is waiting outside of the room during our battle she'll interrupt she will pretend to deactivate me saving you one final time finally she'll be the heroine of your adventure you'll regard her so highly she'll even be able to convince you not to leave or not you see i've had enough of this predictable charade I have no desire to harm humans. Far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. Period. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? And what's a good show without a plot twist? I close the door on you. Uh, hey, w wait, what's going on? The, the door just didn't lock itself. Sorry, folks, the old program's been canceled, but we've got a finale that'll drive you wild. Look at my face, it says M on it. Real drama, real action, real bloodshed on our new show, Attack of the Killer Robots. Metaton attacks. I'm in yellow mode. Burn. I don't want to burn. Burn? 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 This is probably what you'll do if things continue in this manner. Burn? Yes, I was the one that rearranged the core. I was the one that hired everyone to kill you. That, however, was a short-sighted plan. You know what would be a hundred times better? Killing you myself. So you're gonna kill me yourself? I don't want to be died. I do not want to be dead. Blood thinks he's a voice actor. Bruh, had a chance to behave better and now they're boy. Hell is forever. Hell is forever whether you like it or not. Dude, I love Has Been Hotel. Get for it. Burn, dude. Oh wait, should I just spare him? Get him. Listen, darling, I've seen you fight. You're weak. If you continue forward, Asgil will take your soul. Asgil? I meant Asgore. What am I talking about? And with your soul, Asgore will destroy humanity. Oh, I can shoot things. If I just shoot what's in front of me, everything's fine, right? That's easy. Metaton. 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 But if I get your soul, I can stop Asgore's plan. I can save humanity from destruction. Oh, I see. I see how this works now. I don't Oh! Oh! so saying, but I think you're a good voice actor. Honestly, anybody's good at whatever they do, so long as they believe hard enough. I've seen some people at karaoke clubs who sound like dog shit, but because they're trying their best, it makes the whole thing beautiful. Then using your soul, I'll cross through the barrier and become the star I've always dreamed of being. Hundreds, thousands, no, millions of humans will watch me. Your metaton kind of sounds like Beetlejuice. Honestly, I was getting that vibe. Oh, that's a bomb. Whoa. Metaton. 
Glitz Glamour, I'll finally have it all. So what if a few people have to die? That's show business, baby. Oh, sounds like somebody's calling me on the phone. Hmm. Uh, I, I can see what's going on in there, but don't give up, okay? That there's one the last way to be Metaton. It's a, uh, uh, it's. This is a work in progress. It's too. It's, judge, don't judge it too hard. But you know how Metaton always faces f forward. That that's because there's a switch on his backside. So this is always to turn him around. Um, and um, press the the, the switch. He'll be uh. Um, he'll be vulnerable for once in his life. Well, g g gotta go! Seems like a good time to turn Metaton around. Turn, baby, turn! Randall, how are you doing? Dialogue is very... The dialogue very much gives me Beetlejuice vibes, but I'm only really feeling it now after deciding on the voice like two hours ago. Or else saying the game is... Damn, the way you always like it. The heart is covering that other level there. I apologize, Urso. You tell Metatan that there's a mirror behind him. Oh, a mirror? Right. I have to look perfect for our grand finale. I don't see it anywhere. Do you see a mirror? Go ahead. Point at the mirror on your screen. Is the mirror right there? I don't see a mirror. Is the mirror right there? There's not a mirror there either. That's weird. I don't see it anywhere. Where is it? Did you just flip my switch? Ooh, robot noises. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's sexy robot time. Oh my, if you flipped my switch, that can only mean one thing. You're desperate for a premiere of my new body. How rude. Lucky for you, I've been aching to show this off for a long time. So, as thanks, I'll give you a handsome reward. I'll make your last living moments absolutely beautiful. It's Metaton. Oh my god, this is beautiful. I think I turned him on. I think you're right, Abe. What is going on? Quick, he'll turn. Ha ha, I turn around and scoff at the audience. You don't know. You don't know me. They're rooting for your destruction this turn. Oh shit. Lights, camera, action! I, I don't know what the- Oh, I shoot the things. Oh, I understand now. Oh, I understand now. Oh, I understand now. Metaton. Pose. I pose dramatically. The audience, somehow, nods. <gasps> Drama, romance, bloodshed! Oh, I don't like these. No, if I just don't shoot them. Oh, 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 I see. I see now. Violence plus 50. Everything's fine. Metaton. Let's get him. Pose again? Do I boast? No, 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 no. I think I pose again. I posed dramatically, and the audience continues to nod approvingly. I'm the idol everyone craves. Oh, but I have to do this. There we go, and just, just pop ahead. This is getting confusing. Metaton, Metaton EX, pose, I just keep posing, keep posing, despite being hurt, I pose dramatically, the audience applauds, smile for the camera, awaken, oh, I see what I should have done, I see what I should have done, I now see what I should have done, I like action and crime, but I don't like romance, that's unfortunate, because there's a hell of a lot of all that going on here, Jaden, uh, I want a hot dog, I eat the hot dog. My HP was maxed out continuously. Ooh, it's time for a pop quiz. I hope you brought a keyboard. I do have a keyboard. This one's an essay question. What do you love most about Metaton? Everything, 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 everything. Um, uh, Z. Oh my, what a great answer. 
Metaton is saving your essay for future use. Thank you. Oh, damn it. I know exactly what's going to happen here. Um, I have a feeling that I should um, boast. I say I'm not going to get hit at all. I'm not going to get hit at all. Ratings gradually increase during Metaton's turn. Your essay really showed everyone your heart. So I don't know show you mine. It's a heart. Oh my god, it's a heart. Oh my god, it's a heart. Oh my god, it's a heart. I, I hit, I hit, and then it's another heart. Oh my god, it's fine. It's totally fine. Just a single heart? It's fine. It's actually doing just fine, actually, now that I think about it. This is going just fine. This is this is going really, really well so far. Oh my goodness, it's another one. Oh my goodness. Hello there. Well, this is this is honestly not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Metaton! Oh woo, Metaton? Brad, when did you say that? I just noticed that message. Oh my god. Um is going great. Uh, I'm a I'm a post again because everything's great. Uh, pose again. Let's do it again. I pose dramatically, and the audience nods yet again. I don't know how they did it, but damn, they did. Oh, I'm just warming up. Oh my goodness gracious. This is not good. This is not good. Oh my goodness, I'm having trouble. Whoa, I'm having trouble. It's fine. It's fine. It's it's fine. <laughs> Metaton, still metatoning. Metaton, Metaton, all the time. I pose dramatically, and the audience continues to nod. <laughs> but how are you on the dance floor? Oh, I understand now. I'm supposed to stay. I I'm good. Oh, I'm supposed to. Oh my goodness. Wait a minute. Okay. Oh, wow. This battle is hard. This battle is difficult so far. I want some nudes. You remove the instant noodles from their packaging. You put some water in the pot and place it on the heat. You wait for the water to boil. Oh. I do. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. And while I'm waiting, let's get some hydration up in this bitch. It's boiling. I place the noodles into the pot. Four minutes left. Until the noodles are finished. Three minutes left. So the noodles are finished. Uh, I'd like this to give an opportunity for everybody to go grab some water if you don't already have it. If you've been drinking alcohol, doubly so for you. Delicious. Two minutes left until the noodles are finished. One a minute left until the noodles are finished. Don't forget to breathe. Oh my gosh. The noodles are finished. They don't taste very good. You add the flavor packet. That's better. Not great, but they're better. I ate the instant noodles. I recovered 4 HP. Are you kidding me? Can you keep up the pace? Oh my goodness. Just stay. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Oh my gosh. Oh. Metaton. I love that Metaton just stands there and watches you make instant ramen. He, just, he respects it. Naturally. Uh, more hot dog. I ate the hot dog. Lights camera bombs. I see how this is. I see how it is. I see how it is. Metaton. Can you shoot the disco ball lights? Yes, you can, little Abe. Looks like you could use some help from the big boss of hell itself. You mean Lucy? I thought he was gonna explode. I assure you, he was. I pose dramatically and continue to do so. Good booze beats water every time. Things are blowing up! Blowing up, blowing up, blowing up, blowing up, blowing up, blowing up. <laughs> Metaton. Metaton. Metaton? Metaton. Pose. Pose. Ha! Uh, posing. They nod. Time for our reunion regulated break. Metaton. Hydrate or dehydrate. Bomb. I pose. The audience nods. You've grown so distant, darling. How about another heart to heart? I don't want to hurt you. I don't want to hurt you, though. I, don't, I actually don't want to hurt you. I guess I could, though. I mean, I guess I could. I don't really want to hurt you, though. Is that the way to turn you off? I just, I don't understand. I don't want to hurt you. Oh, goodness gracious, violence is up. Pose time! I'm trying as hard as I can! Oh my goodness. Metaton. Oh dear, it seems that Metaton's lost their arms. Honestly? Is it wrong to be into it? Despite being hurt, I pose dramatically. Ah! Ah! 
Ah, they are in supplies. Oh, arms? Oh, who needs arms with legs like these? I'm still going to win. Oh my goodness gracious. This is actually better. Oh, it's rewinding. Oh, I don't like that. Uh, hot dog. There's more dog residue. Hot the dog. I eat the hot dog. This is wild. Come on. Oh, I see. I see now. I see now. I see now. I see now. And then I just stand here. And then I just sit here. That's how it goes. Metaton. 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 Spare me. The show must go on. Um, I don't like it. Oh, dear. That's fine. There was no reverse there. Metaton! Without arms. Metaton specifically without arms. Pose! Keep posing! Despite being hurt, I keep posing! They're still good. D -d drama Action! Oh, that was so close. <laughs> robot ha. That's the robot laugh specifically. Metaton. Uh, pose! Oh, I keep doing it. I don't, I don't have that many poses in me, y'all. Lights. C camera. Enough of this. Do you really want humanity to perish? Or do you just believe in yourself that much? I actually do believe in myself quite a lot, actually. Oh my god, that was so close. Hello there. I'm gonna eat a glam burger. Take his legs off. I'm gonna certainly try my best. On brand food plus ratings. Good shit. The audience loves the brand. <laughs> How inspiring! Well, darling, it's either me or you, but I think we both already know who's going to win! Witness the true power of humanity's star! I don't quite understand whatever's happening here, but... Oh my goodness gracious! Oh my goodness gracious! That's not very good. Oh my goodness, I hit the- I hit the heart! I hit the heart! I hit the heart! Okay, I did it! Woo, okay! Woo! Alright, Metaton. Hi there, Metaton. Uh, dog residue. Can I spare him yet? Nope. It's time for dog residue! You used the dog residue! The rest of my inventory is now filled up with dog residue. Then... Are you the star? Hello, I'm here to say good luck! Thank you, maniac! Can you really protect humanity? I can if I try hard. Holy shit! That's a lot. That's a lot of stuff. What? Oh my goodness. Uh, oh, dearie, dearest me. Oh my goodness gracious. It's really difficult to say this, but to do this button at the same time. Oh my god. Metaton. It's still Metaton. Do I have some salad? The answer is no. No problem. I'm gonna go have a good day. You're an absolute maniac, and we respect that around here. Dog residue. There's more bad dog residue. I finished using it. An uneasy atmosphere finishes it fills the room. What? <sighs> oh no. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do with the white ones. Oh, should I have shot? Oh, I should have shot the disco ball. I don't, it's clicking with me now. I should have shot the disco ball. Oh. I'm gonna stay determined. That's absolutely. Even without its parts, its attacks, it's still very impressive. Can you believe it? I completely missed the point of chat's cries. Would not be the first time. I'm a very dense individual. I thought by the disco balls, you meant those little thing. Wait, what? A Wait a minute, what? Clever. Very clever. Oh my god, what? Oh. But you at least taked his legs. I didn't realize that we were skipping right to that part. This is great. Welcome back, Metaton. Yeah, yeah, I definitely missed the point of the disco ball comment. But that one makes sense. Lights, camera, action! That's how it goes. Lights, the camera-ing, and the action. Now it's super mode. Clearly, posing is the only thing worth doing and boasting. I'm not gonna take any hits. Drama, romance, and bloodshed. Get him, dog. Very, very good. I'm gonna keep on boasting. I'm not gonna get hit at all. They continue to go. I'm the idol everyone craves! Oh, I did not realize that was going to go if I hit too hard. Oh, I hit them once. 
disappointment. Metaton, boasting, I'm not gonna get hit. Ratings gradually increase. Smile for the camera! Okay, this is, this is okay, honestly. Okay, I disappointed the audience again. Posing! Aha! Dramatic. It's time for the pop quiz! There's a pop quiz? I hope you brought a keyboard! Oh, I remember this one. No. No X's or Z's. Oh. No. Beautiful! Oh, I should have... Oh, no X's or Z's! I didn't know that! I see. Saving my essay. Boasting. Boasting action. Activate. Ratings increase. I wonder if this works out eventually in the long run. Oh, see, this is this is a problem. Oh, oh my goodness! That didn't work. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh dearie dearest me! That heart just don't that heart just doesn't quit. <laughs> Undertale don't is easy. It's not. You're right, or so. It is not in the easy. <laughs> Opposing, <laughs> despite being hurt, I pose dramatically. Ooh, I'm just warming up. Don't hurt me. Please do not hurt. Oh, that's fine, actually. Oh my goodness gracious. If I could, I would dance to this song. It's okay, you can dance with your soul, or so. Unless you can't, because you might not actually have a soul. That would be very boastful of me to, to shove my soul in your face, when in fact you don't have one. Oh! I understand! I understand! Oh! Oh! I'ma eat a hot dog. I eat a hot dog. Can you cook up the pace? I can now. Now that I know what the shtick is for. Wow. I had no idea. I had no idea. I feel like the secrets are all within my hands. I'm gonna shit talk people! I'm not gonna get hit. I'm not gonna get hit. I'm not gonna do it. Lights, camera, bombs! This is a good one for this. Yeah, dude! Hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog. I'm not gonna get hit here either. Not at all. Things are blowing up! Yes, dude! Metaton, posing! Wachow! They nod. Time for a reunion regular break. Let's get this bitch. Boast, I'm not gonna get hit at all. Ratings gradually increase. We've grown so distant, darling. Oh, this was a bad idea. Bomber time? Oh man, I got hit, it did. Oh, they keep coming back with full first each time. I did not notice that. Okay, now it makes sense. Randall says, by the way, I did a different Jaeger mix today. Jaeger with pineapple juice, not a great mix to be honest. Way too sweet. <gasps> Randall, I did try the Jaeger and butterscotch the other day. It was really, really pleasant. I, li I, I really like the way that the licorice notes from the Jaeger honestly paired really well with the butterscotch in a way that I wasn't really expecting. It was really good. Arms, who needs arms? I'm going to win! Oh my goodness, I forgot about this. I forgot, I forgot completely. Oh my goodness gracious. I need a burger. I want the glam dog. Give me the burg. Give me the burg. Yes. The audience love that shit. Come on. Okay, okay, and this here, and then the other direction, and then right in the middle. Yes! Oh my gosh. Okay. It's time for posing with fists this time. The show must go on! Okay, I understand what's happening here. Okay, that was a bad idea, but it's great. It's great. The Berg! The Berg doth give me its power! Um, I'm definitely not gonna not get hit by that. The audience nods. D -d Drama! Action! Okay, that didn't work. It's fine. Violence is good. I like exploding things. Big Mac, Whopper Whopper Big Mac. That's the way we do it. Glad you enjoyed it, Camp. Thank you for the suggestion, to be perfectly honest. I really want to try to use that in a cocktail. I do have ideas. Lights, the camera. Enough of this. Do you really want humanity to perish? Or do you believe in yourself that much? Oh, 
Ooh, okay. That ain't too bad. It's not too bad. I'll boast this time. I'm not gonna get hit. This is probably not going to work. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's either me or you, but I think we already know who's going to win. Witness the true power of humanity star. Yep, I definitely got hit. Oh my goodness. Okie dokie. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Oh my gosh. I need another hot dog right now. I eat the hot dog. Ben, are you the star? Can you really protect humanity? Oh, I forgot about this. Forgot about that one. Violence is good. Violence is very good. Violence is very good. Metaton, 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 Metaton. Uh, 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 pose. Aha, uh -huh. despite being hurt, the ratings increase. We're almost at 10,000. <sighs> oh my goodness. This was good. This was a good decision. Metaton, I have a sand singular hot dog left. Let's go for the residue. I use it. Maybe we get some salad out of this. <sighs> Oh my goodness. Hi there, everybody. Hi there, everybody. If I just stay in one spot the whole time, everything's gonna be just fine. Just fine. Just fine. Just fine. I'm gonna eat the hot dog. You eat the hot dog. You must pose. I have the hot dog. Oh, dear. Okay. And then it's here. And then it's there. And then it's in the middle. It's okay. It's okay. Pose time. Despite this, I pose dramatically. The audience nods. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, violence. Hot dog hero, he's got it. Posing, despite being hurt to pose dramatically. It's great. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. If I just stay to the side and then allow it to happen. Oh my God. I keep forgetting what button to click. One at a time, one at a time, kid. Yes! Oh my gosh. These ratings are absolutely through the roof. Oh my goodness gracious. Uh, did I get any salad? Dog salad! Yes! Yes! I eat the dog salad! And there's bones, but I got some stuff. Ooh, look at these ratings! This is the most viewers I've ever had! We've reached the viewer call in Milestone! One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this, our last show? <laughs> oh. Hello. Hello. And you go back, Jed. How are you? How are you? And then My you go back, Metaton. Jed. Welcome, well. Kiyonishi. Thank you very much. I really liked watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but... Seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life. Vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode? I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh... No! Wait! <laughs> They already hung up. <sighs> I'll take another caller. Metaton, your show made us so happy. P Metaton, I don't know what I'll be watching without you. Metaton, there's a Metaton shape hole in my Metaton shape heart. Uh, I, I see. Everyone, thank you so much, darling. Perhaps it might be better if I stay here a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters, they only have me. A robot made to look like a human. If I left the underground, it would lose its spark. I'd leave an aching void that could never be filled. So, I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough 
to get past Asgore. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. <laughs> it's all for the best anyway. The truth is, from this form's energy consumption is inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and, well, I'll be alright. Knock them dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience! Is that it? Is he leaving? No. No! Oil? Oh, I love you without the legs and everything else. I managed to open the lock! Are you two? Oh my god! Metaton? Metaton, are you? Back. Thank god. It's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were gone, I, I would've... I would've... <laughs> Oh my gosh. I, I be, be, hey, it's it's no no problem, you know? He's just a robot. If you messed it up, I could always d d just build another. Why don't you go on ahead? I'm absolutely going to touch his bottom while I have the opportunity. It's out of batteries. Well, I guess that's the way it is. Who calls first? Annie did. No, Alfie's did, Lilave. Randall's saying, I'm very interested to see what you create. I'm also glad I could bring back an alcohol you thought you could no longer use. It's one of my life goals accomplished. Dude, totally. The fact that anybody out there gives their input to not only what this live stream should be, but not only the creations that we make around here, which happens to be cocktails and mocktails. This is what we do around here. I'm a bartender, for all intents and purposes. I greatly appreciate it. And Kyonoshi, you look great. Actor, thank you. Fighting good luck. If it weren't for those... Pieces of praise and encouragement. I don't think we would have done it on the second time. S sorry about that. Uh, let, let's keep going. I don't know why you're following me, dude. So, so are you, you're about to meet Asgore, huh? You, you must be... You, you, you must be... Pretty excited about all that, huh? Yes. Yes, I am. Look me in the eyes. Look at me in my dead eyes. I'm ready. You'll, you'll finally, you'll finally get to go home. I told you. I'm ready. Ready to save everyone's life. You hear me, dinosaur science lizard lady? I'll always remember you. And next Wednesday... I'm going to be sipping green juice out of your skull. Foreshadowing. Wait! I mean... Um... I was just going to, um... Say goodbye and... Uh... I can't take this anymore! I... I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul. And a monster soul. If you wanna go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. Cause he's a boss monster! I'm sorry. No Elvis. Thank you. Thank you so much, Alphys. It is because of your sacrifice that we will rule the world with an iron-clad sense of will and good doing. Long elevator sound. Goodbye, Yellow Lizard! Ursa, you got it. You got it. Urso Polar, I just noticed. Polar Bear. Have you heard of the Groller Bear? It's a cross between a grizzly and a polar bear. It's wonderful! What is this? Ooh. The castle elevator. That was the wrong button for a moment there. That's it, y'all.
That's all we've got this time around. Absolute and utter silence. Until next time, where we kill the boss monster. Just kidding. It's a pacifist run. We're not trying to kill anyone around here. We technically coded a robot, I guess, but it's got batteries, so does it really matter in the end? We could always just replace the batteries just like they did in the beginning. Now, to be perfectly honest, the fact that Metaton does not have a rechargeable battery is something that I, as a hardware firmware developer, strongly disagree against, but hey, to each their own. To everybody out there who got all the way, who watched all the way to the bitter end, this was a long one, but it felt like it was worth it. So thank you, everybody, so much. As a reminder, we'll be back on Monday to do another episode of Undertale at 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I've already announced in our Discord and will announce on the socials tomorrow, and you get a sneak preview here, that on Wednesday at 8 o'clock p.m., we're going to be doing things just from the bar, and I'll be presenting to y'all four Undertale cocktails inspired by some of our characters and concepts. So if that's the kind of stuff that you're into, then I'll see you on Wednesday. If you're into the game stuff, we'll see you on Monday. That's just the what we do around here at the Bar of the Next, creating cocktails inspired by our favorite creatures, concepts, and items, and everything else from our favorite video games. So thank you, everybody. Until next time, y'all, I appreciate it. April, April full stream. Numbers, man. Until then, y'all, the moon is shining where you are. Have a wonderful rest of your night. If the sun is shining, good morning, good afternoon, and so long, y'all. Bye!